So I don't really know what... Oh, it opens the doors. Okay. Whoa. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Alright. I was expecting arms to come through and try to grab me. Thank you for the bits, anonymous cheerer of doom. Oh, what the fuck, dude? You're up the, uh, oh. Wait, what have I done? What have I done? Wee. <laughs> All right. That's only, you know, a little scary. Oh, fuck. Damn it, chef. Ooh. Didn't see that one. Ooh, the, ooh, shit. It's, the, it's running away. What is that? Look at the fucking fuck! Oh my god! Come on! The one time I'm like, let me get up close and personal with something, and then... Like, I don't want to pull this out, because I feel like that's supposed to go in there. I didn't see nightmare. Not nice. At least that's what it sounds like. Which means the trainers probably didn't do a very good job being like, yeah, no, no worries. We could still, you know, do this. That's fine. No. You should know that you can't fix them at that point. Oh, fuck! I do. I feel like it's gonna update in a day or two. That's weird. Yeah, try. I'd say try again after. Um, yeah, it's probably like tomorrow morning. Check again. That's really the strange. Mail. The mail comes every day. Holy shit! I think it's an actually attack. A bottle of something and a, another bottle of maybe some water. Although it's a nice glass, who knows? Not too shabby. It's locked. Okay. What's this? Oh, fuck me! Jesus! Oh my. Why did I just fall for that? How's your day been? Hi. Sir? Sir? No, oh, fuck! This is fucking hilarious. <laughs> Sleep well, my dude. Thank you for dropping in. I appreciate you. 
Um, I'm sure I'll catch you on one of your streams soon, too. Love you, buddy. <laughs> the fun I can ever. <laughs> Sweets to the sweet. The pitter for the pitter. I'm so fucking It just seems too simple. Oh, okay, good, good, good. I'm like, mm, I'm not buying that I'm not supposed to progress forward here. So much gold. Oh, never mind, it's empty. It's so dark on stream for you guys. It's dark for me too. Ook. You fucking asshole tree. God damn it. <sighs> fucking just spazzed. Oh, I'm so dumb. Oh, fuck. Um, I got fucking chills. Okay. Fucking ads. Heard bad things about, so I decided to skip it. Ah. In the white room with bad curtains. Oh, fuck, fuck. I never noticed at the end of the... Why is that back? I never noticed at the, uh... At the end of that, um... That clip, you can hear me cracking a beer like... So defeated. <laughs> awesome. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Uh, I don't even know what day of the week it is anymore. It's Saturday. Saturday night. <laughs> That's why I'm starting at 10. Um, the bit-a-thon has come to an end. Thank fucking God. Oh, my word. <laughs> we raked up so many fucking spins. So we have 54 points, and that's... um. What was that? That's eight. That's eighteen. Uh, first, that's eighteen spins. Maybe it's nineteen. Actually, no. Anyways, math aside, there's like eighteen spins and another eight we got from the bidathon. So there's twenty six fucking wheel spins, um, that I have to do. It's <sighs> <That's> a lot. <laughs> I think I'm gonna slowly crack away at them. Or maybe we'll, um, maybe I'll make like a redemption point thing. Hmm. And you have to like cash in on one of the spins immediately. That would be interesting. Hmm. Just slowly drink an entire bottle of hot sauce. No. I wouldn't even do that with like the Verde. Like the Verde is the easiest sauce in there. There's no way I could guzzle that down. Oh my God. Why would you say such a thing? <laughs> God. Why I never. How are you tonight, Tree? I say bumped the fucking mic. Yikes. Oh, I'm worried about tonight's beer. I bought a, uh, I made my own little, uh, six pack or whatever. Uh, I think it was like Monday or Tuesday this past week. And I haven't got to this one yet. It's from Lone Pine, good brewery up in Portland, Maine. And it's their, um, I thought it was their, their, a sour that they make, uh, with different fruit, fruit varieties. And it's called, uh, Sparkler. I like the fireworks sparkler thing. This is called slush punch, where it's actually 
a sour ale, but it's imperial, meaning it's going to have a lot more ABV on it. Of course, I can't fucking read it. What's the ABV? Don't be trashy. Please drink responsibly. I like that. It's imperial sour with cherry, tangerine, lemon, and key lime. I didn't, I didn't read the key lime part. That's pretty cool. Where's the fuck? Oh, the ABV is seven and a half. Seems logical at the time. Good. Got a lot done around the house. Good. That's as good. So I'm worried about this because like every other imperial sour I've ever had is not that great. And it maybe it's just a style that I just can't get with. But Lone Pine makes a good straight up sour. So I'm hoping they figured out a way to make that an imperial version without going too over the top. So cheers to you, Tree, and anybody else lurking in chat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it smells strong. Boy. Oh, my God. That tastes like a slush puppy. I just need to add in, like, crushed up ice, and it's a fucking slush puppy. Holy fuck. Okay. Um, I need to go buy more of those. <laughs> oh. Oh, and the key lime makes it a little fluffy at the end. Mmm. Mmm. I like when I find a, a really good beer. Ooh. Got the chills just thinking about it. Anywho. <laughs> um. So, a couple pieces of news. Nothing too major. Um, first and foremost, tonight... Tonight, we're going to continue playing Amnesia Machine for Pigs. Even though I've not been loving this game, um, I'm not as in tune as I was with Amnesia The Dark Descent. But I still want to play it. I want to know the story uh, before we move on to Amne Amnesia Rebirth. Moho, welcome in. How are you doing, friend? Um, yeah, because I want to get Rebirth done because we got the bunker, um, which is the fourth Amnesia game. We got a key for it. And I want to make sure I get a, a good turnaround time on it. So we got to fly through these games. <laughs> um, I feel like we could have beaten this yesterday. But um, we ended up playing um, Death in the Water 2. Uh, right at the end of the bit-a-thon. And it was, uh, it was worth it. That game was fun. I'm going to be going back to it for sure. Dorian, how's it going here? Good. Just chilling. Just found a very nice beer excuse me oh and then uh so tomorrow um i don't know if i'm going to stream it or not however there is going to more than likely be a uh a boomen uh, stream tomorrow with me and some Channel 13 uh, friendos. And we're going to be trying out the new um, the new multiplayer version, uh, the versus mode in that game, essentially, before you are all just a team of robbers trying to uh, burglarize a house. Fry, welcome in and welcome home. Hope you enjoyed your time in Italy. Um... Oh my god. Fry's Howard Dean scream completely threw me off. Oh my word. I already talked about amnesia. Oh, tomorrow night. Um, so yeah, essentially you're a bunch of uh, burglars burglarizing a home for specific items, but it's a haunted house. Uh, now the versus mode is that you can actually have a human playing the ghost trying to hunt the burglars. So uh, that'll be announced tomorrow. Or maybe later tonight. Um, just got to finalize who's going to be involved and whatnot. Um, and, oh, the other thing I wanted to bring up for those that were not on, either didn't check, maybe you're not on the Discord. And if you're not, if you're not, you'll probably be part of the Discord. There's the link. You can use it. I promise. Um, 
but yeah, um, uh, I made uh, we announced it at the end of last stream, uh, just some final numbers and whatnot of uh, of the bidathon, and I just it's these numbers are fucking massive, uh, I'm honestly blown away at the the amount of people that were here hanging out and like the the fucking um the virtual postcards from everybody was just that was a lot like i was so overwhelmed and after after stream i like laid in bed and just stared at the ceiling for a while and i was like wow holy shit <laughs> it just it just hit me hard i guess and it was it was super appreciated and um yeah, go. I was like, you need to go to bed. <laughs> you don't need to be jet lagged. Go to bed. Get some fucking sleep. We will catch you soon, I'm sure. Um. So just to to wrap up on some some stats that I grabbed uh, last night after stream. Uh. So there's a total total amount of bits cheered, twenty six thousand two hundred sixty seven, which is a wild number two six two six seven. Uh, 52 Takis eaten. <laughs> well, I mean, I ate the rest of the bag today, let's be honest. Uh, 26 whiskey shots. There's probably some more in there, because there's a couple that I, like, doubled up on, but I didn't want to go too high, so I just said I did a one-for-one one there. <laughs> Five beer chugs. Uh, not counting the beers that I was just randomly drinking to get hot sauce out of my mouth. Three, ste three Steam gift card giveaways we did. Uh, 66 sub uh, subscribers, whether that's new, renewed, um, gifted, or prime. Uh, 26 wheel spins due after numerous other spins I lost track of. Yes, that's, that is true. I lost, I definitely lost track of some, but I, like I mentioned before, is 18 and 8. 18 is what we have working with on the actual counter, and 8 was what was earned through the birthday bidathon. Uh, 14 hours and 41 minutes of stream time. One game completed. We uh, we beat Layers of Fear 2. 10 new followers, which helped us surpass the 750 follower goal. So the VR horror stream is going to be happening very, very soon. Uh, and of course, one very drunk and happy chug. That's me. <laughs> so, so yeah, thank you all again. Um, I had such an amazing fucking week off. Uh... And it's definitely recharged my batteries a bit. Um, and like, and even outside of stream, like some conversations I had, some different things I would have to be reading. Um, just a lot of, a lot of the right things were said to help me mentally. Uh, it was what I needed this week for, for sure. Ooh, yeah, I might get into my drinks tonight. I feel like I need to kind of let loose. It's Saturday night. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Brian, what's up, man? Fuck, I really need, like, crushed ice now. And a four-pack of these. I can make legitimate slush puppies with that. Oh. Oh, my God. Three, thank you for the raid stream points. 86% raise. We getting close. Yo, BB, thanks for the lurk, bud. Waving if you can't hear me. If I directly pass around for Fall Guys, I'm going to apologize now instead of later. That's fine. <laughs> I'll leave this here. Love you, brother. Thanks, buddy. Um, uh, I feel like there's one more piece of news I had to bring up. Amnesia. Tomorrow night. Uh, the bit of thon final stuff. Hmm. I don't know. All I know is that next week we're definitely moving back to the regular schedule. The uh, Monday, Thursday, uh, Monday, Thursday, Saturday, the three nights of the week. Um, I actually almost I was toying with the idea of actually taking Monday off and then streaming on Tuesday instead. But um, I think I'm going to be good because because tomorrow night I'm definitely at least playing. I don't know if I'll be streaming, but we'll see. Uh, I think that's all I really got. Nothing else really exciting, I suppose. Um, other than uh, hopefully getting through the Amnesia series and then uh, 
the third layers of fears will be coming out i think on tuesday this upcoming week and we still have killer frequency which is a new game we got uh it was gifted to us through rank one which is really interesting i'm so glad i got to be back in time to hang during a b-day week man me too yeah it was uh it was something Okay, I could sit here and just fucking vibe to fucking Alcest all night, but I feel like we should probably, well, tell you what, okay. I'm not even going to touch the counter. I'm just going to work off of the ones that I owe for um, the Bitathon. So let's do that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do one and see how I'm looking. Here's one so far. Get rid of that. <laughs> I thought I disabled that completely. Ah, the chocolate. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. I could do that. I could do that real good. Oh, I put it in the fucking freezer because I'm an absolute smart aleck. <laughs> Okay. You can see where I took it, like a legitimate bite out of this and that was it. I didn't want to grab the other sides of it. Look. <laughs> Fucking animal. <laughs> um, yeah, this this actually, this chocolate bar, the chocolate bar from hell, is actually quite good. There's, there's definitely habanero in it and it's hot, but like by comparison to everything else, I'm like, I can eat one of these. This is not too bad. I'd put it on a s'more. Oh my god. A spicy s'mores. Oh, someone write that down. Please. It's not feral. <laughs> oh, you mean the bite is? Yes. Uh, yes, correct. <laughs> I feel like the spicy s'mores. Word. Okay, okay. All right. Here we go. Uh, there we go. See? You got a free chocolate, man. I'm telling you. Unless you're going to write out, like, you're buying it straight from Hershey Park. Free your fucking chocolate. Just the tip. Yep. Mm-hmm. 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 <laughs> Thank you, Mo. I mean, I don't know. I'd say it's pure genius, but it's an idea, and I want to kind of try it. I mean, I don't want it to be like fucking. Hey, throw a Carolina Reaper into your chocolate. No, 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 no. Like this right here. It was just it just tastes like chocolate, and then there's like there's just heat afterwards. And you're like, oh, oh my. Oh, that must be the campfire speaking. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's... Honestly, it's good. I could... I think I could have eaten that whole chocolate bar in one shot and been fine. I mean, I didn't need to eat a whole chocolate bar at once, and that's probably the reason why I opted to take a bite out of it. <clears throat> so. But yeah. I wish there were more of those around. I... <laughs> I think Amanda randomly got me that from, like, a day trip she was on with her mom and happened to find it or something. She was like, oh, I got you this. I'm like, bring this upstairs. But uh, that just means if we get one more, um, one more hit on the chocolate bar, then it's gone. We need to think of something else to put in the wheel. I don't know what else. To, I mean, like, I could add absinthe back in, but... I need to get like, uh, excuse me, whoo. I need to find good sugar cubes for that. I want it to be like legit. Um, cause I haven't had absinthe in a long time. Like I've had this bottle and I opened it 
at a like I think we hosted a party and I opened it and someone had a glass of it and that was it. I haven't drank it. But like I don't know why would you have a like a whole fucking glass? It's like put a little I don't know, mix it in with something. Be, be be realistic. Unless you want to do it legit with the sugar cubes and all that. <clears throat> Anywho. Yeah, honestly, I think I could do one more. I I can I can let's see what one more is gonna do for me. <sighs> Famous last words. Yes! Ugh, let's fucking go, man. Two for two, Juggy. Fuck yeah. The Verde sauce does have a kick, by the way. Like it's still it's gonna be it's hotter than the chocolate bar. But like out of all the hot sauces, it's definitely it might be the easiest one. All right. All right. So this is the uh, the Gonzo Verde from Gonzo Sauce, right? So it's your typical like green hot sauce. Um, I, I, honestly, like when it comes to knowing differences of like hot sauces and peppers and stuff, I'm really honestly not that smart about any of it. Like I don't really understand any of the concepts or what's good with where, like what and where and what's used in what salsas and all this other shit. All I know is that what's on the back of these fucking labels and that some of the words mean really hot, the other ones mean like I could probably survive this. <laughs> so, anywho, this one in particular is rated hot, two out of three. It has Sereno chilies, tomatillos, yellow seven pot chilies, roasted onion, garlic, cilantro, vinegar, fresh lime juice, and spices. And um, I feel like if I ever, if like next time I make huevos rancheros, who am I kidding? The next time Amanda makes huevos rancheros, uh, I'm going to grab some of this from up here and I'm going to put it on there because shit's pretty good. I mean, obviously having it just straight is a whole different scenario, but anyways, cheers. Mm-hmm. It took a little bit. They got there. All right. That puts us down to, uh, was it six left? Yeah. We just did two. So we got six left from the bit of thumb before I can even touch the spinner wheel. All right. Tell you what. As much as I want to be a gambling man and do that spin one more time. Um, I also want to start playing, and uh, I know the odds aren't that good on the third spin. <laughs> I feel like I got myself into trouble with that before. Uh, so we're start playing, and then um, maybe I'll take another uh, break, and we'll spin it one more time. We'll see where we go from there. So, without further ado, let's go hang with Amnesia, a machine for piggies. We got audio, good, great. <clears throat> so I have no idea how, like, I think if there's like the random maps in this factory that we're in, I'm assuming is that we have to get through all of them, we'll get to the end. But there was like a, some early stages that didn't count there. I went the wrong way. Oh, right. Did I do this yet? I did. Okay. Yeah, this thing. Like, what's this thing down here? Is this just when we go deeper? I don't know. I don't remember which way I'm even supposed to go. Oh, okay. I think I remember this hallway. Oh. 
Oh, right, yep, and I dropped down there to get back to the main spot. There it is. Click. Oh. I wonder what's supposed to be in the third thing here. Maybe I shouldn't be in this room. Okay, never mind. It just it, it just dinged. <laughs> Alright, what did I do? All I did was close down the other fucking things. Uh-oh. I think I fucked something up. Otherwise, it opened a door somewhere up here. Huh. I think I fucked up something. Because it still needs... That has a key and I can't go through that way. Right, I think I was supposed to, like... This stuff can make, like, corrosive shit. I think that's what it was. It's some form of bizarre mixing device with chemical compounds that possibly reeks of the foul fluids I've seen too often before. It's clearly a compound, some volatile bastard of two composite ingredients I should wager I would find them close by. Right, and I got all of those. Well, both of them. All of those. And... Oh. Whoops. Wait, is this it? So it gave me uh, the journal update here. A handy brew. I have the compound. It hisses and steams in its container like some living thing. A witch's jelly to burn and corrode. The container is made from glass. A strange choice unless there is some particular reason why the metal that pervades everywhere else cannot be brought into contact with so-called compound X. I should investigate further for clues. Okay. So you're telling me I'm going to bring this upstairs. And I'm just going to throw it at the lock and it's going to fucking blow. Or, or melt. Something along those lines. I mean, that's what I figure. So let's, uh, let's wheel it back in a little bit more. Right? Right there. And launch. Uh, okay. Did that not work? I'm, uh... Uh... Fuck. <laughs> now what do I do? <laughs> I don't know if that's supposed to happen, or if there's a bug. And that door's also locked. I am currently stuck. Unless there's something magical in here that it, I didn't know existed. No, there isn't. Uh, oh boy. What did you do this time, Jug? Can't click that. Unless it just, like, takes time for it to kick in or something. Candy! Have a good stream. I'm gonna go have brunch with the family. See you later. Ooh, enjoy. Thanks for popping in and saying hi, though. I hope you get some good food. I'm sure I'll see pictures of it. I don't even have to ask. What the fuck? I forgot about that. Can I take these and, like, plug it in right there or some shit? No? Fucking hell. Of course, haven't posted yesterday's food, too, but I will. <gasps> the fucking audacity. Unbelievable. Worst content creator ever. <laughs> What's up, one time? How you doing, my dude? Fuck. 
God, I really hope I didn't fuck this up. Oh, there's teeth. What the shit? Wait. I can move these pieces? That's pretty funny. Strap someone in here, I guess. Christ. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. Oh. <gasps> Let's go! Let's fucking go! Hungry? Eat up! My bad, too busy enjoying good food. Food. But, but true. Oh, no, I'm gonna keep this up. Maybe you guys can actually see. Faster, faster! Imagine this is the end of the game and I could have just beaten it last night. I mean, I don't think so. Showing off? <laughs> Next chapter. Yep, this leaking world. And the rhododendrons seem to be taking over the garden by the wall. I could dig them for you? No, no, get out. Get out of this house. You leave them be. Okay. Hello? It wasn't that far of a drop. Oh, come on, dude. That shake, dude. Look, I... it, it's... Thank you, Ash. You guys probably heard the fucking game double. It's coming through my speakers I have some as well. That I want to like <laughs> share with you so we can like do these things. I'm okay, and they're like, I have, I a, have foot a foot fetish. <laughs> October twenty second, eighteen ninety nine. Naturally, once bled, the product must be scalded, dehaired, and scraped, ready for gambling and evisceration. For this, we pass them through the steam reservoir, which is kept at a constant temperature by passing excess high pressure venting from the engines. Uh, excuse me. Via the boiler in a series of large copper pipes into a stone chamber just below the workhouse. At the center of the machine, there is a com component that must be kept at a consistently low temperature, which controls operation of the processing of product throughout the system. Alongside this, refrigeration is of the utmost importance in retaining product quality. And this also. Alexa, stop. I'm not even talking to her. Uh, it also requires heat to be removed from certain areas of the machine. Two problems are therefore combined into a single solution. The removal of heat from some areas and the requirements for increased heat in others. Conducting panels draw heat using the principles of convection, regulated by the boiler, and sending freezing air along one set of pipes in one direction and superheated vapors in another. Huh. Okay. So that's how it's going to work then. <laughs> Discharge. My Apple Watch says all the time while I teach, and I'm like, shut the fuck up, I'm not talking to you. We can use this to supplement the steam production and ensure constancy. God, the stench. The stench. Fecal matter is the true product of the age. The flooded tunnels. My mysterious friend is correct. The sewers are indeed flooded. To descend further, I will have to find the local sluice pumps to drop the water levels. The smell is almost unbearable. It makes me gag. Why should the saboteur have flooded the tunnels, though? What did he hope to achieve? I don't know, a distraction? I think that works. Fucking smells terrible. Good thing this isn't a fucking scratch and sniff video game. Oof. No. Th no, they're not. They're seriously going to recreate the invisible water monster from the first game, but it's going to be an invisible poop water monster? God damn it. Why do people do this? It's awful. <laughs> Before I go this way, 
have to know what's in here. Oh yes, the invisible poop monster. Yeah. Alright. Fun. Maybe one of our friends. Okay. I'm right at the corner on him. Ah! Problem is, how do you turn... I don't know if you could turn that handle. Because it's, uh... It's not low enough. There's where to be another door we can open somewhere. But it'll do the same thing. Oh! Oh! August 1st, 1899. Several of the older forms have breached their containment area and escaped to the sewers. They remind me of my limitations. This is no chem, and I am no uh, Eliu, at least. Not quite yet. What? It is the heat generated from it keeping the door in between open that is to blame. We cannot simply pack them up with coolant as we do with the center where the doorway is. The later versions are kept safe by the freezing temperature of those towers. Up here, where the air is hot and fetid, they become they become overheated, and their duality tears them asunder as the other place flies from their cells and their vitae splinters. They live sporadically, torn from one world to the other and back again in violent, unpredictable bursts. For a few seconds, they are creatures of this world, then they are torn away and cease to have physical form. This vicious ripping back and forth between worlds has driven them quite insane. I have ordered the affected area sealed and will not allow my loyal workers to enter. These are damned places now. The abode of failed experiments. Ghosts of fear and spite. Jesus. Alright. This isn't ringing? Wow. Yes, we are in these sewers here. We were up here. Somehow got all the way underneath. Sluice gate two, sluice gate one. Let's fucking turn this bitch. There we go. Alright. I'll be there, weirdo. Can I turn this more now? Let's go the other way? No. Can't do either. Got it. I need one of you. And I need to put you there. But you're not going to let me. We got an action that doesn't go there. Never mind. But that just means that it says sluice to me. Maybe just it's the light because it's the, the other one's nearby somewhere. But that's important. Maybe it's this one over here. Nope, still no. Not low enough. But hey, that was important. Oh, that's sluice gate too. <laughs> Fuck. That's the way I was coming from. No, it's a different set of hallways there. Or I'm making it up. Oh, fuck. He's actually up there. Alright, that's Lusky 2. This is Sluice Gate 1. I don't really know what that did. Other than just opening these up. Although if I go the other side now, I can go do something over there. This will do that. Oh, sorry. I meant to say, it's like this other side of this gate over here. That one over there. I can cross over. And go through the door here. Because those are the gates. That, so it's opening up. These are the gates. Apparently not that. 
Or no, maybe it is too, because it's open now. Hmm. Whatever, bro. Ah, perfect place for a sound recording. But we can save them. We can set them free. We can replace a rotten old world with a clean new one. Mr. Madness, you sound every bit the fanatic. Well, how can I be otherwise, Professor? How can any man of ethics simply stand by and watch this world drown in its own excrement? And your engineer, this visionary with whom you have embarked upon this course, does he share your views? Indeed he does. Indeed he does. The poor fellow has seen it all before. Now, this is not the first great civilization he has wept for. And so you set about things immediately upon your return. Naturally, naturally. These things cannot be left to rot upon the tree. And sponsors were remarkably easy to find. I tell you, Professor, a trail of greed brings rich men to your door like pigs to truffles. <laughs> like pigs to truffles. Oh, this is a big circle. Uh, so I have to go in there the way the fucking pig went. I don't even know if it's, a, if it's a pig. It's like a human, a pig, a dog. Let's go this way first, please. That was a good idea. Nothing to pick up here. Where I could, oh, no, hold up. February 17th, 1899. All right, so I was making a Twitter post. What did I miss? Uh, lots and lots of poop water. Um, invisible poop monsters. Oh, and, and, and dog slash pig slash human things. That's what I got. That's it. <laughs> and I said, look, my darlings, can you see it? And they said, yes, daddy, yes, we see it. A tall weathered cap of a steep sided pyramid, so like those of Egypt. Stone falling away from the summit, vines crawling about intertwining the stucco serpents, stucco serpents that thrive about the steps. A palpable sense of stillness. A weight of forgotten. In this, here, this is where the king sat, and this is where the priests lived. This house, this is the house of the dead, and here, where the sun strikes, this is where they threw the hearts that were not consumed. No, my darlings, they most certainly were not savages. You see, they believed that the sky could fall on their heads. And they truly, truly believed that offering blood was the only way of stopping this from happening. Perhaps, my darling, perhaps they were mistaken altogether. Or perhaps their tragedy was they could simply not spill blood enough to prevent the sky from falling in upon them. Wow. <laughs> so, normal, gotcha. I did ask thought you were still talking to me. You were reading. Ah. <laughs> yeah, yes, Brian, my darling. <laughs> Remember back in 1899? The awful poops, uh, the, the, the twitch poop... <laughs> Just shooting everywhere. Oh, cool. Great. A My journal. Mandis post diluvian. That's done it. Now I can enter the strange decontamination chamber once again and move onwards. The waters have pushed back, making the way to the bilge clear, where I can divert the remainder of this filthy turret back into the Thames where it belongs and clear the path to the center of the machine. 1899, where Shat hit the fan. Yeah, I remember. Puts Walking Cane away. <laughs> Fantastic. This is t Fuck you, dude. Oh, this is from the main menu. We've also used one of these before to open the other door. I get the. Oh, that's right. They could close it with this. I'm lying. Can't do anything there. Or there. Oh. That'll do it. Alright, so now... That closes it. Nice. And then this is where we let some out.
Oh, it just does. Okay, great. And then... Open. Nice. <laughs> like, hello? Well, this place is... This place is tiny. Um... A big motherfucker. Oh, there's two of them. More, if I would uh, assume. Oh, my fucking God. Yeah, this is their fucking lair that I just stumbled upon. A nest of wretches. Dear God, a whole nest of these foul creatures. No mind. Mind six have drawn me thus far, and I'm sure somewhere in this dark complex is a means of further descent. I will not see their faces as they go about their dark business. And yet, and yet, I watch them sleep and eat and play, and they are so very human, so very childlike. And I will not think of what I have seen, of the chairs and the cages, and I will not think of how such monsters may be sculpted. Yeah. It's exactly what you think it is. They were put together... with different parts of other different human creatures. He's like, we're fixing it and making it a more beautiful world. Yeah, I, I see it. I was like, do I dare open up these doors? Yeah, he was, that's good enough. Reverse Soylent Greens, yeah! Exactly. Okay. I don't know if you guys hear the music or not, but I'm assuming I'm going to get DMC it at some point. Let's check this one first. this oh yeah we don't want to open these up then sleeping on top of his cage weird oh I found it. Well, that was easy. Okay, I can't take my flashlight out, apparently. Going further and further into the darkness. Ooh, flashlight came on automatically. Oh, great. It, we're literally in a tunnel. I can't believe how dark this is on stream. Like, it's, it's like a light green for me. What the fuck is that? Ow. I didn't think that was going to hurt me that bad. That was easy. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> God damn it, tree. Why can't I go down? It won't let me it won't let me climb down. That's so weird. Oh, there we go. It wouldn't let me before. You you did kind of get me there. All right, and if another set of oh, both of these have ladders, I don't know which way to go. I'm gonna keep going down. It's all I can do, I think. This is the true dark descent. <laughs> See what I did there. Oh my god. Another fucking ladder. 
How far into the earth are we at this point? Are we effectively playing hidden deep now? How am I still here? Lies. Lies and fucking slander. Oh, is the bilge pump maintenance access, though? We got it. We tied his spine. It's gonna be shroud or something to bled. Old Elise fly blown. Old Elise dead, and dreams of the jungle will flood through her head and light up her head. Okay. You seem to have undergone quite a profound conversion in Mexico, Mr. Manfield. You could not have seen it yourself and not, Professor. As we disembarked, even through my fever, I saw the detritus of this so-called progress. I saw starvation and disease, rot and destruction polluting the waters of the Empire. We are ruiners, you and I, and all of us, and we make the world unclean. And you took it upon yourself to act as Redeemer. <laughs> Professor, I Excuse will me. not be so presumptuous. I am merely a conduit. I am constructing an architecture to wrestle our damnation to the ground and smother it with steam. Smother it with steam. Mmm. That's what I'm talking about. I'm glad I'm randomly healed, too. Because there's no, like, med kits in this game, or there's really no health meter or anything, either. Alright. The pump rooms. These must be the bilge pumps. I'm at the heart of the saboteur's efforts. In order to keep his flood in place, he must have disabled these vast pumps. But he was clearly rushed. Thus far, he has left most of his work incomplete. His clumsy efforts were due to simply switching off all that he could find. If I can locate the controls, the remedy will be simple. Great. What could possibly go fucking wrong? <laughs> I don't want to go in there. You can't make me. Up we go. Ahead, the trickle to still waters. I drag myself deeper into the temple, downward ever. Towards a wind that held the voices of my children, beckoning me to set them free. Yeah, bro, I'm pretty sure you're, those, those aren't your kids anymore. For instance, that one just exploded in front of your face. Some say uh, the child blossomed. Uh, it blossomed into a giant red fern and then disappeared. It's just a big circle with nothing here else otherwise. Oh. What the fuck was that? Right in the middle of the screen was like the a pig mask appeared and then disappeared. That was bizarre. Okay. Let's find things he could have switched off. This looks off. Where's the switch for it? Hmm. Must be at the control room, naturally. Stop. Ensure all wheels are in place for correct operation of pumps. Uh. Yes. Um. Yes, yes. Yeah. No. Uh, maybe? Oh, fuck. Great. Oh, puzzle while you do a puzzle, because we like to puzzle while you puzzle. Looks like it's running. I mean, I'm no expert, but... 
It's doing something down there. Monster Mom, thank you for the uh, the rage stream points. We gotta be getting close. Yeah, you know, if I could have put something here, there'd be a, like a hand icon. So I think I'm good. That's all running. Awesome. What's next? Oh, all right, all right. I don't know why I thought that was going to be a good idea. Ah, it opened up this door, I see. 87%? Damn, we close. Okay. Valves and pipes. Another pump. It seems once again I must engage it. I cannot help but feel I am trapped in some great game, forced to undertake endless Herculean labors for the promised reward of my darling children. You keep telling yourself that, bud. If anything, you're just doing someone's work to turn this machine back on. That's all I'm getting out of it. Whew! Fuck. Fuck, I can't go that way. Oh my god. Oh, oh god that sucked I'm like it's interesting those things are down there I can kind of see where the uh the pathways would be kerplunk what's this way literally nothing awesome and this way we shall go hey noxy baby welcome in dude there's the pump controls yeah we're down here now down deep like real deep oh see this one's missing one we gotta put it in And we're also missing one. Son of a bitch. Oh, there it is. How are you tonight, Knox? How about that barbecue? Any good shit? There we go. That one's operational now. Suppose I go this way. Hmm. Oh, fuck. This doesn't look good. Can I drop this ladder first, please? What the fuck, dude? That is stupid. I couldn't shake that. Oh, I'm fucked. Uh, I have to pick something up. Oh, throw rocks at it. Thank you. Got hurt for nothing. I don't see the point of going down there. But I was supposed to jump down via this way for some reason, and I really don't know why. There's nothing else to, like there. I think I just got fucking straight up trolled. Pretty sure that's what it was. Yeah, because now this door's open over here. I bet. Oh, maybe not. Made it all up. Oh, okay, I see. Now I can actually go down to this floor. 
because they won't be on this anymore. They would have somehow just decided to jump up and over the banisters and not stay. You know what? I'm not going to complain about it. <laughs> Don't stare a gift horse in the mouth, you know? Calm down, you. Let's turn this fucking wheel. Let's go. Deeper and deeper we go. Nothing of great substance here at all, except for that door. That's the only point. Core systems access. Oh boy. The children dancing. He obsessively scans the newspapers and periodicals for new inventions. They are the architecture to elevate uh, ev uh, us all. Why, why can't I read that word? He proclaims. Edward and Enoch just play on, unaware. Evolate? Yeah, it's probably supposed to be elevate. I think that was uh, a typo. When did this game come out? <laughs> or did I pull a complete Nox and go dyslexic for a second? And I'm not being I'm not being insulting. <laughs> March oh the Ides of March March fifteenth eighteen ninety nine curled into my bunk all sick and sweat ridden. They clean my room about me, but I can only hear the voice from within that gentlest of stones. It sings to me and I dream of a great machine. We'll build a new world from the ruins of the old. We'll plant flowers in the rotten rib cage and let them grow to hold the sky from falling. I remember how it whispered to me as we rolled as we rolled sick and heaving. I remember when we pulled into Southampton and we both wept for it was every bit as much a desecration as had been sung to me. And then we came to London and I set it up a upon the mantelpiece and went into the house and gathered the servants and set on recrafting them and then I went into the garden and buried those tiny shattered skulls under the weeping bulges of the rhododendrons. Jesus. It was pretty fucky. And now we go for the journal. Oh, finally, the flood is drained. I have prevailed. The saboteur is beaten. My heart pounds with excitement. Even as my head spins and shudders in feverous anticipation, Hell's machine now throbs about me, sensing its rebirth is imminent. Rebirth, son of a bitch. The final descent beckons me to enter, as Lily once lay on her wedding bed and summoned me into manhood. Wow. A little aggressive. So good. I had some homemade cherry mead. That stuff tastes so good. I can drink so much. And it's like 90%. It's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, the fucking meads are really good. And when they first said, Daddy, my heart was molten. As if blood frozen upon the ground were held to be held to the sun to thaw and stop. And they were inseparable. Always together. One soul and two bodies. And my love was all consuming. I would die for you. I whispered to their sleeping faces. I would kill. I was to this world to ruin and protect you. I have fought through dark tunnels, great engines, the foulest of beasts. I have set my covenant and drained this flood, and I am come for you now, my darling boys. It's like wine for men. The fuck's that supposed to mean? It's just, it's, it's wine. It's made with honey versus grapes. I'll go this way. Stop. No unauthorized persons to enter this facility by order of the management. Well, fire me. Question is, which way? Well, that made things easy.
I don't know, I'm weird, man. That's true. Meet him, feed him, then just breed him. Oh my god, tree. <laughs> From your children, Magnus, to spare them the world you have created. No, it's about the same thing. Well, so glad that <laughs> Fuck! Oh, you bastard! Oh! Fuck is wrong with you? Right as I was stepping into the fucking elevator, too. Oh, here's the machine. Alright, so I wouldn't have beaten this last night. We've had to play for like a whole nother hour. Well, I guess we did play a little over an hour with uh, Death in the Water 2. So, I mean, we could have. I think you're asking the wrong guy. See what this door goes to. Your mom beat it last night, and not yours. <laughs> Rod control room. <laughs> and they feel no pain. The process is completely humane. Last room. Humane, Professor. That we judge the acceptable level of suffering by the human condition. Ask the beggar, Professor. Ask the orphan. Ask the whore. Hey. Ask the starving, Professor. The weak, the sick, the filthy. Ask them to define your humane. So I'm not too sure... Like what we're switching here, like on off of what these even mean. So I'm gonna keep going forward and see what that if I figure out a, a reason for it. There's no new journals, right? No. Okay. Good 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 good. That was a much uh, easier ladder ride. This one's a bit longer. Danger. Compound X. Highly flammable, highly corrosive, highly toxic. So don't touch it. Oh. So the switches is where the rods are going into. This is the answer. So we need to shut off some here. I think that's what it's trying to tell me. So it's one, three, four, five, six, one, six, eight, one, six, eight. Yeah. I think that's right. One, six, eight. <laughs> Fuck, you know what? I knew someone was going to fucking do that. <sighs> One, six, eight. God damn it. Oh, it goes the other way, but still. It's still... Thank you, Ash. What? Why can't I do this last one?
Okay, all right, hold up. You can only put so many rods in at once. <laughs> so this probably means I have the numbering backwards there. Like down here, it's a square, and upstairs it's a fucking rectangle. Actually, I did that right. Did that right. So how do I close that one? That's the question. Because all I've done is be is just lower the rods into him. Figure that door probably opens over there or something. Oops. Get out of the get out of the water. <laughs> um So that's that's the eight spot, and I it won't let me flip that. And that one's the one I tried to put in and it freaked out. Probably because it's closed. So maybe there's a better, there's another option to actually close those lids instead. It's just in a different location, which seems kind of like a stretch if you ask me, but whatever. Actually, I tried doing this here. Well, now it works. What the fuck? Before it wouldn't go over. Alright, well now we're good. They're getting lots of uh, cardio in with this fucking up ladder, down ladder. Alright. Good, good, good. Still can't do anything about that. I did something for somewhere else. So I can't open that. I thought it may open automatically. I wasn't too sure. But it must help somewhere else along the lines. So we would have had to backtrack at some point anyways. Or it's completely useless and I feel silly. This is just this one door. We still got two flights of stairs over here. Both lead to the same point, yeah. Thought so. I tried. Ooh. I tried so hard. I will uphold my promise. I will always protect them for you. My eyes are your eyes. My heart is your heart. I will rip them loose from this rotten world and set them to burn. All to save them. All right. Can't go up that way. What's that? Alright, so what are these switches doing here? I don't know where these go, I don't know what they do. I guess they're flipping them. Alright, so we ain't flipping shit. Hmm. Some interesting uh, symbols there. And I can't go up here? That's a bunch of bullshit. Alright, so this room seems to be a waste of time. It's fine, I suppose.
can't do anything else with the elevator. Okay. And this one has no other way, right? There's a branch off to the right somewhere. No. No, straight shot as you at like the other side. Fuck. I can't even jump over the fucking bars. Alright, so something about this control room. Let's see, what does the journal have to say? Oh, it's a new one. <laughs> The badge has been here too. This is the epicenter of his meddlings. This is where it began and this is where it will end. I'll seek the source of this obstruction and then I will render this sabotage impotent once and for all. Final act of sabotage. I mean, okay. Hmm. I wonder how I open that. Maybe I can lift it open or something. Yo, Jeff, welcome in. Oh, I wanted to push him into the laser. Nice. <laughs> and that's an achievement. That's so the fucking good. The shattered mood mining cannon. That's awesome. I approve of this clip. Achievement. I was just like, man, I just want to fry that dude. <laughs> what a dick, huh? <laughs> so good. Welcome in, Jeff. Hope you're doing well. I hope you're able to figure out how to get back up on your ship. <laughs> I'm here with the Jeff Raid. We what's up? Let's get rolling. Welcome in. Happy to have you. We're just uh trying to I I swear on any everything. I looked down and tried to look. <sighs> it wasn't a fail. I found where I needed to go. I just swear this game's been messing with me tonight. Because before, this switch over here, the number 8 switch, I tried pushing to the left, and it would go immediately back to the right. Here we go. So now... Ding? Oh, you know what? Now I can go flip those switches. That's what that's all about. Yep, journal just updated. Ignition control. Now to find ignition controls and start the machine once more. Elated, I stride forth upon these catwalks. I'm coming, my darlings. I have almost saved you. Bro, you ain't saving shit. You're... Fuck off. God damn it. Thank you for the bits, but fuck you. Oh, yeah, go bring that pup out. Yeah, yeah. Oh boy. Why well, can't I? Oh, there it is. Set them free. Set them all free. Set them all free? Do I have a choice in the matter at this point? Because, like, I'm, I'm almost positive I'm going to flip that switch and these doors are going to fucking slam shut and I'm going to have no way out of here. Well, unless, of course, this finally opens up up here. But... Oh, God. And who else are we saving? It's supposed to be my children, and that's it. Hmm. Turns out I'm about to release an entire world of bear man pigs to the earth. Fucking knew it. Oh. Shit launched me backwards. 
I rise. I will rise to bleach the sky and steal the water. I will spin the world wheel and set the future upon the path to redemption. Where are my children? You promised me my children. My time is come. More pig. More pig. More pig. Boys. Boys. I'm sorry. Your kids I'm have sorry. been dead, dude. Yeah, look at him. Oh, ho. Oh. Is that it? Mantis Saboteur. There are feats of engineering contained herein that would make even those clever fellows at the Institute real with envy. Hello? Where the fuck am I? And, emerging, I raised my head to an uncaring sun, and I cursed this world of pain and despair. Engine rooms? This civilization built on the ricketed bones of the unfortunate, on the greed and swell of mammon and empire. Yee, how goes the music? I should have tracked him again, sorry. It's all good. I think we're at the end of it. I kissed my children farewell, and I crawled my way home. Yeah, you never had a chance at saving your kids, bud. I told you the whole fucking time. You didn't listen to me. Yep, here they are. Oh, what was that? Oh, it's pig masks. 29th December, 1899. Can a man construct himself anew? Can a man unrealizing who he is and what he has become? Tear himself apart down to the bricks and begin again. Are our souls just this? Tiny cog wheels and clockwork? And intricate machines to serve a function that upon reflection we might set to a new task? Can a man, defined by his actions, defined by that which he now finds abhorrent, set to sabotage in his body, his machine, until the children of his soul turn into new motion, and he may wake to a new sun, a new year, a new century with hope in his heart? As I reach my hands to the exposed wires, I ask myself this. Is redemption possible for such a creature as I? And if not, then surely better to die amongst my creations than to continue to live as a monster. Holy shit. Um. Alright, so that's how we're ending this? Fuck. Ooh, another. I can't look at the journal while I'm apparently climbing. Pressure regulation. The trade. So it is done. The saboteur was me, and the voice on the telephone was him. But what of us? How do we connect? Surely I cannot be responsible for all I see about me. I cannot remember. I cannot remember. All I can grasp is a moment when the world split into two pieces, and the innards of humanity fell from an orifice torn agape into my open. <laughs> bifurcated? 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 Bifurcate? That's a C, yeah. Heart. Steam vent access only at low pressure. Okay, good to know. Where are they? Where are my children? Where do you ask, Mendes? To the dead. Look, we know they're dead. August 31st, 1899. Children really are the most wonderful, useful creatures. The unfortunates from the orphanage have provided indispensable in cleaning the larger steam pipes. It appears that matter from the slaughtering process may indeed vaporize its source, but drifts like dust through the air and lodges on the pipes, causing them to foul. Periodically, we shut the pressure down and send one of our pixies into the pipes to scrub their reconstituted fat away. Oh my god. Armed with just a shortened broom, other explorers venture into the dark. Of course, we can only keep pressure down for short periods. They must be fast, or they risk being trapped and boiled by the superheated vapors when they rush back into the system. Bro, what the fuck? 
Then we'll be sending their comrades and afterwards to scrape free the cooling mess. The survivors tell me you can reach all manner of place within the complex through the pipes. I smile, tell them I am so proud, and then feed them to the pigs. Fuck. Such a crispy word. Yeah. Holy bastard! We gotta hurry before he turn, somehow turns the fucking pressure back on. Unless, of course, he's nowhere near us. Will it hurt them? A oh. cleansing fire always burns, little Mandus. Little Mandus. I need a beer. Makes anew. Did it hurt to carve out the fevered flesh? Did it hurt to cut free the gangrenous foot? Ask instead this. Can we save them? When did I say that? That is not me. That is not me! God, I can't fucking see. Can I get my vision back, please? It's all fucking hazy. All the fucking pig's masks on the ground. Oh, there's, uh, there's two cribs here. Oh, God. There's two cribs rocking back and forth very slowly. I can hardly fucking see them. December 1st, 1899. There's a spoon of medicine, I says, and it's a silver spoon we did get born holding, ever so painful for mummy dear, but grasped so hard it was in a little screaming red fist. Later you used your spoon to dig a hole in the garden to get all the way to Mexico, and then you did eat worms with your spoon on the way to stay fat. The spoon was the same you gave your twin, then you used it to dig a hole to, into their clockwork souls, you eat up their hearts, like soup on the way to keep you fat. Fat little mole. Where will you dig next? I ask you and your little silver spoon made from the silver spine of your children and wrapped in the hair of your dearly departed. Dear sweet Jesus, my darling little Beth, what have I what am I become? So now what? Nothing? What the fuck? What's that? Oh, that's one way to do that, okay. Mandus is a saboteur. It seems that the pressure system is indeed the Achilles heel of this facility, something I clearly did not realize in my first clumsy attempt at sabotage. If I reroute the system, I can wreak havoc. I mean, like, don't blow up yet, please. So I just want to play Great Lines in the graphics looked amazing, but it seemed clunky when I watched it's a play and he rage quick. Have you heard? Yeah, the game's terrible. Um everyone I know that's played it has all said like the same type of shit. Where it's like you can't tell where like the next objective you're supposed to go is. Like after a certain point. Um a lot of people like their fucking PCs just turn into a goddamn jet. Um, like a fucking jet plane immediately when they start playing the game. Uh, it crashed Brecky's stream at one point. It's just like, it's just absolute dog shit. We have here. Cause I, w I was think I was gonna play that ten uh, last night. But, um, yeah, I was reading up, it's bad. Yeah, go. This I'm pretty sure it's mostly negative um, in Steam. It's like I think it was like thirty percent earlier. 
Some form of steam regulator. I'll wager if I disable it, the damage caused by the rushing steam pressure could be catastrophic. So enough to force temporary stalling of this entire engine. That should cause the steam pressure to drop. Man, as you clever old goat. I can feel this horror, this grief, this betrayal boiling to fury. I will not stand. I will not be undertrodden. If this machine is my heirloom, I am the overman. Okay. You just want me to fucking throw these things in it? Like, what am I doing with it? Cool. That was easy. Oh, fuck me! That's a big... Oh, fuck, they're everywhere. Ladder, ladder, ladder. You No sirree. Not playing with that shit. Haha. -ha. Journal. Into the pipes and out of the engines. Now quickly through the pipes before the pressure returns and they fill with boiling corrosive steam. I sense the machine snarl itself about me. Its unholy inhuman mind coil and slick and send its dark tendrils through its conduits to repair the damage. I'll return to the streets. I will fetch help. And I shall lead the people upon the factory, burn to the ground and seal this evil place underground forever. Right here. Oh, what the fuck? That hurt. Steam vents. All about me, the thunder of machinery, the blast of boiling steam. Oh, it's I time, baby. oh shit, baloney boy! Welcome in. Guys. Welcome in, Trakers. Guys! I'm dead. Demonic, what's up? You ready for the schmeeks? It's a baloney Woo! raid. I need help. I need assistance. I closed the wrong door. Oh my god. I hate doing that. You closed the door on the wrong way. side. I'm slow. I'm dead. Oh. It's, it's been a What's long up, time. Laser? Welcome in, everybody. How's everyone doing? I hope you're doing splendid. I'm bad. I'm the baddest motherfucker in the world. Oh, shit. Happy Jugiversary. Yeah, seven months. Thank you, Laser. Hey, handsome. How is this? Are you asking me? Oh. Oh. Um. It got better in the second half of this game. I had a lot of, like, goofy issues with it, and, um, it doesn't stream very well. Like, I almost maxed out the gamma, and it's very dark on, on stream, apparently. <laughs> Trakers, glad to hear you're doing good. I'm doing all right. Just, uh, trying to get this amnesia game done so we can play Rebirth and eventually the bunker, which I hear very good things about. Is that Noxler I saw? Oh, it is. Almost a full baby. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's it's streaming, but it's like, I have to keep my flashlight on the whole fucking game so that people can see. Um, but, like, story-wise, story's pretty decent. Um, the mechanics are, are kind of the same as the first Amnesia game. Um, but it's, I wouldn't say it's... I'm not as scared as the, uh, the first one, but we're pretty much about done with it. And then we'll be playing Rebirth after. I mean OBS filter? Oh, uh, yeah, that would have been smart. I should have done that. I'm going to head out, but have a great one, Jug. Thank you, Trackers. Thank you for coming in. We have a lovely evening. Um, so for those of you that came over with Baloney, I'm assuming you know about Channel 13. <laughs> but if you don't... Oh, Trackers, thank you so much for the fall. Welcome to the mob. I appreciate you. Um, yeah, please subscribe to Channel 13 on YouTube. It's free. Um... It's it's essentially our, our team of horror streamers. Uh, and you get to see all the different compilations of jump scares of all of us looking like children. <laughs> so check that shit out, if you haven't already. Alright, let's keep going here. Oh, fuck! That fucking hurt, bruh. Yes, it is. Yep. Stop you. I will save them. You are too late. It begins. My work has begun. Kill them, my piggies. Kill them all. Oh God, the piggies. Yes, I do have a top fifty compilation video. That's correct. I, 
I was supposed to pin that message on here and I forgot anything to save them. Burn away, burn away the remnants, the parts that will not process, the waste, the, uh, the offal of your world. They grip the system and stick the wheels to the temple floor. The entrails achievement unlocked. Emerge onto the streets. It's only four out of seven. I must have missed three others. It's so good. Yeah, Brecky did amazing. Yeah, I crack up at the credits. <laughs> Yeah, Breakfast did a fucking fantastic job. Love the video view, it's hilarious. Thank you, Baloney Bot. I appreciate you. <laughs> These aren't the streets. Oh! They're fucking everywhere. Breck, you always does an amazing job, for sure. Alright, now we're on the streets, for sure. Box Row, can I go in here? Damn it, nope. Oh, God, no, what have I done? Oh, my God! Look at the booty! Oh, damn, he's fucking packing heat. <laughs> Whoops. I was hoping in the end credits would be all the ways he is misspelled your name over and over. <laughs> oh god. Dude, that would have been funny as hell. Cares. October 25th, 1899. No one misses the poor. Round up some orphans and the world will thank you for it. Disappear a horn, a gentleman applauds you. Call a beggar and a lady walk safely again. I hate them. I hate them more than any of the others. This privilege, this pretension. These so called leaders, these pillars of society, these rich and fanciful. They wear their filth on the inside, but they are no less dirty. I have plans for them all. We will feed them and then we will feed from them. Oh, Yikes. Bad, Yo, Eris! What's up? Welcome in. Oh my god, you look like Carl Grimes, Eris. <laughs> <laughs> the screams in stereo. <laughs> Fucking scatter! I'm pretty Welcome sure my in, everybody. Just came out of my mouth. <laughs> uh, dead end. Are you Michael Jordan? Yeah. Like, I, I yelled like Homer Simpson. <laughs> That's amazing. Also, damn it. The little tongue wiggle and everything. I just realized that my fucking sub counter fucked up. There we go. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. I'm Jug. Eris, how are you? How was your stream? How was Labyrinthine? I am playing Machine for Pigs. Yeah, I love pigs. Yes. Um, I think we're towards the end, actually. I walked away. Where am I? Uh, you were hanging out with the Jug mob, and I'm Jug. I don't know exactly how you got here, through which... Uh, Raids. We had a few raids come in out of nowhere. It was a stress fest, my guy. Oh, I, I bet. I bet. <laughs> in purgatory. Oof. Yikes. Okay, laser. <laughs> we jug in. Hell yeah. Um, quick favor. If all of you like watching people get jump scared so much. We love our Juggy boy. All you motherfuckers follow Jug. Thank you. Jug is a fair judge. I don't know about that. But thanks. All the same. Um, if you are a fan of jump scare compilations, just watching streamers shit their pants playing horror games, and you're not following Channel 13 on YouTube, please do so. Uh, it's a fantastic team. Uh, an amazing uh, video editor. And uh, we, are, we are growing. So hop on that train. Jug is a fair jug. Yes. That's also true. <laughs> Yo, Mo, thank you for the rage stream points. Now we're at uh, 88%, real close. So, yeah, so welcome in, everybody. Um, yeah, so I, I'm Juggernaut. I play uh, mainly horror games, occasionally some other shit here and there. Um, 
the community here is known as the Jug Mob. We all hang out uh, either here or on Discord, typically. Um, and we're trying to get through all of these Amnesia games. I've played the first one a couple of years ago, was going to play the second and third one, this being the second one, Machine for Pigs, and then third being Rebirth, because uh, Rebirth had just dropped, and I was like, oh, I should play all three of them, and then I played one and didn't go back to the uh, the other ones. For whatever reason, I don't remember. Uh, now the fourth one, the bunker's out, and we were lucky enough to get a key, so now I'm like, okay, I need to go, get these done. Rage stream. So rage stream is gonna be me playing a bunch of games that aren't necessarily horror games, but they're gonna make me rage and like get tilted. Um, for instance, we played um, Getting Over It the last time. Fucking terrible game. <laughs> it's the only one I haven't seen. Oh, because I can stream to playing gamer games that make him rage like crazy. Yes. <laughs> Ladies got Getting Over It. Yep. We tell the story of Bar <laughs> Barbara the Bar Bar Barbarian. Yeah. Yeah, that too. <laughs> I want to watch you play Cuphead someday. Is that one you streamed? I can't remember. We did play Cuphead for a bit on that last stream. One of my points for only one purpose. Well, you can only give a max of 2,000 a day um, or stream. And that is not by my decision. That is something that Twitch does. Um, there's no way I can change that. Otherwise, I, I would. I, I would put no cap on it. I don't think I've ever laughed so hard Jack would write to that. Yeah. It was a few people actually kept going on it. Kept adding to it and shit. It was really funny. Oh, fuck. I think it's time to switch games. Yeah. Yeah, after I fell all the way back to the beginning. Yeah, I was all done at that point. Fuck. I shall not be driven to the rage stream. I only have one goal. Oh. Redeem your, Redeemer? Is this Miro? Die as pigs. Ooh. You need to stream more? Wow, excuse me. Shut up. 23rd December, 1899. The story had me so confused. Um, it's There's definitely some, like, holes in the plot. Um, but essentially, our character um, was tricked by this crazy guy who is basically testing on, um, like, how to basically rebuild humans with other animal parts like pigs that's the biggest part of it and um the machine was shut down it was like sabotaged and um we were given instructions on how to like get like through different areas to get to our children who were missing because it was behind a flooded area we got rid of the flooded area and turned the machine on and then realized oh this dude just wanted the machine to turn on so he'd have his army of pigs <laughs> thus here we are But yeah, it's 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 not as straightforward as like the first one was. I stand looking at myself in the mirror. Penis in hand. <laughs> and my reflection grins at me, and his mouth is full of the sulfur mustards. Vain I'm feeding the shit out of his ball bag. Yes. Vain fool, he sneers. Are you really so very different? Do you generally believe your works of evil are any greater than the rest of them? You are simply a weak man, a product of his age, the same as any other. This is empire, cre a cretin. This is the killing idiocy, the natural result of this social Darwinism. If you are evil, then this world is evil. You just let the blood run the street rather than hiding it in the poorhouse. You hold the blade and slide it home yourself. You do not pay a man to do this for you where you cannot see it. If you are evil, at least yours is an honest evil that alone makes you ubermensch and thus I wash my hands and take to bed fuck <laughs> Jeff thank you for the rage stream points okay Do you hear me, Mandus? This 
I'm glad none of them are paying attention to me. I didn't plan this. Areas for horses only motor carriages must use alternative entrance. I'm gonna skedaddle time to play some Stardew Valley till my partner crashes. I'm gonna go bother some chickens. <laughs> well have fun, Mo. Appreciate you. Have a lovely evening in Stardew. I hypothesized from some of the notes that he contracted syphilis and as the disease spread to his mind, this is the great idea he came up with. Oh yeah, that's true. Hey, he said it. Oh, fuck. I don't even know if he's chasing me, but I'm gonna pretend like he is. Oh, fuck, he is chasing me. Fuck. Oh, haha, -ha, fuck you, buddy. Dude, your children are fucking dead. How are you not understanding this? Like, it's very obvious at this point. Love you too, Mo. To the pig line. Oh, God. So many pig masks. Here we go. I, I, I thought this game was just about over. Now we're going further down. Farming the world, a missing vein. I see this now. We, the game just fucking crashed. I hope there's an auto save feature. Cause I haven't, I didn't hit save and exit at any point in time in this game tonight. Oh my god. We're going up? Weren't we just going down? Actually, I don't know. I hit the switch and we didn't even move, I don't think. Oh, we're back on the streets. Okay, that's not terrible. I can go back through this pretty quickly. This is obnoxious. At least there's no stamina bar, so I can just fucking run to my heart's content. So I forgot about the flashlight. Redeem these nuts. Chasing me. Oh, 
Hey, <laughs> Zonum. Oh, fuck! I almost didn't make it. Zonum, thank you for the rage stream points, my dude. Ah, fuck you, I win again. Alright, it's the journal. Like, we're good. Hey, hey. Where are my children? Where are my children? Alright, let's see if it crashes again. Oh. <laughs> Fucking dudes went running past us. Uh, the kids went running past us upstairs. That was funny. Z, how you doing, man? Permanent the world, let us not be coy. I will not let us drag this corpse of civilization into a new century. Come to New Year's Eve. I will fling the last switches unshackle the full power of the machine. So this is how they made Farmville? Oh. All right, hurry it up. Fucker, you almost had me. Thank you for the bits, tree. But I had to bed but wanted to hang for a bit. We appreciate you wanted to hang, man, and you're always welcome, you know that. Counterattack, I returned, an angel of vengeance! A saboteur once more. I'll find a way to stop this vast enterprise of slaughter. Enough destruction opened to the heart before. Confused the machine enough to surprise its locks and secret doorways. I must cause a great shock. Stab its eyes, poke hot wire to its ears, hammer to its teeth, and push glass to every orifice. <laughs> Yikes, bro. Then it will gasp, and in that gasp, I will scuttle into its throat and stab its heart from the inside. That got Connie? Haha. <laughs> Yeah, I played Farmville a lot too. I was uh I was commuting to college at that point when it was at its peak. Man, I would sit there and I got there an hour early before classes, and I'd sit there and sit on my Farmville for the entire hour. Oh yeah, this place again. <clears throat> I could have gone upstairs, too. What is this going to bring me to? But will they be free? Yes, my friend. Drained of blood and freed from the prison of the flesh. Free to ascend as smoke to the stars. And the good. The worthy. How will we save them? Show me these worthy, Mandus. Show me these good. I... Do not see them. Very visceral imagery. Yes, agreed. What's that say? Danger compound X, no naked flames, no unshielded electrics. Well, who's found a way to make that happen? This vile concoction, this compound X, is the arterial blood of this horror. Boiled, it creates the steam to drive pistons, but here it is freezing and flows about the components to keep them cool. Why should it be that the deeper I go, the cooler it becomes? What great process generates such heat that the machine must quench it with a cocktail of blood and effluent? Well, we're going to find out, aren't we? That same thing here. Oh. I sense opportunity, my first strike. Impeding these cogs with a large enough object should jam the flow of coolant, causing a pressure buildup that will split the pipes and rupture the tanks. Good plan. Now what the fuck are we gonna throw in there? Nothing to grab around here. Are there rocks back up here or some shit? Never played Farmville? Yeah, I think Farmville's done for now at this point. Tell me I can just roll these things in. Oh, baby. Oh, you poor, poor baby. That did it. Ha 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 ha. Sons of bitches. I broke your shit. 
I better get out of here before it all explodes on me. What do you mean? That's the way I came from. Oh, I have RuneScape, yeah. Uh, hello? Mr. Flash, light. Can you fucking leave? Gross bastard. This ugly sack of shit. Just standing there, Mr. Flashlight. He just he just wanders back and forth like a fucking dumbass. That's not good. I couldn't fucking move. I guess that was not the right way to go. Maybe it was. No, it definitely wasn't. Okay. That's fine. Let's see what else is up here. Hurry! Of course, I forgot the unsheathed electrics. I think I just killed all of them in the other room here. Yep. Let's go, baby. Now you can drop down, I bet. Yep. Cool. Alright, I dig that. Alright, here we are at the Pig Line Central Operations. What's this? Coolant pumps. Spark plug. God. The trippery? I can't do any- Oh, okay. Oh! Fuck! Alright, start spinning this thing, I guess. That seems to work. More. Bring it all down. Bring it all down. More. Oh, I can't touch that. Okay, this is it's all done. It's done. We're good. I know you, machine. I know what you fear. I will rain excrement into your very soul. I will destroy you. I will destroy you. My great works are almost begun. <clears throat> December 2nd, 1899. Walk away from those temples, that small pile of stones under the rhododendrons, the skulls of innocence under the loose clod, headless rib cages in the cool, sto cool stone behind the altars, 3,000 miles apart. I trace back my life to this instance. Rain channels eroded in ancient stone. The toxins are already in this damp, this falling water. I hack and rush and vomit into the sink and grasp the bowl with both hands and stare. There in the plug hole, as clear as day, a toy spine, clockwork and intricate, like a child's spine. But clockwork, how could that be? How could a child's spine be made like clockwork? I washed it carefully and placed it on the mantelpiece. By the egg I laid myself onto the garden where the children's skulls are buried. I call it my Mexico. It's fucked. We are the pig. We are all the pig. Oh boy. 
Uh, going back way down again. I know you guys can't see anything. I'm sorry. Gonna make a brownie cup. Be right back. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can... If at least the ending of this, if I can max this gamma out. Uh, you can kind of see. Once I turn the flashlight on, it gets better. Yeah. I am here again, at the foot of those stairs. Towards the red light. When I type Twitch to my browser, your link is the first to populate. Like a bleeding sky. The horizon a slit throat. It's kind of sexy. The seeping dark to drain the guilt from Not as sexy as you. So. I am the jaguar-faced man. Jaguar-faced man. This priesthood is mine. I mean, shit, dude. I can meet him. Ah. Oh. Great engineer. How marvelous. I must say, Mr. Manders, my excitement is almost unseemly. Yes, I can see that. Step this way, Professor. I will be right behind you. You know what else is really sexy? This cone I'm loading to the fucking brim. Manders. Damn. I type in hot I men who like you. red and whiskey, and you just down come down up down. on Google, to be honest. Manders. Which is funny, because red's not even my favorite color. My children! I founded you! Yeah, pull your hearts out. Mm -hmm. Ice cream? I had some raspberry ice cream tonight that lasts like a wine cooler. Mm. Not quite that type of cone. <laughs> What is your favorite color? My favorite color is green. My god, this is awful. There needs to be something else I can do with graphics to make this, like... ...fucking doable. A bunch of restarts required on half of this shit. No shadows. No bloom. No image trail. Sepia, no radio blur, color rating. Okay. Water runs in my veins, now I am keen. My favorite I color is green. Factory, the bowl of this mill. And I, I feel like that was the right choice. But it still doesn't look very good here for you. I I'll just look at this. Big old river of blood. Rivers of gore! Rivers of gore! I'm sorry. This is a giant room filled with blood. And there's a random elevator in the middle of it. What shade? Like shamrock green or forest green? Probably closer to a forest green. Like a darker color. Alright, here we go. Giant room filled with blood was my nickname in high school. <laughs> no, that's a giant bag of skin filled with blood. The veil lifts, the bride is waiting. The man eats the pig, and the pig is eaten by the machine. And the man is eaten by the machine. This is as it ever will be. All the happy little trees. Like, honestly, if I had what the stream had for coloring and shading, I'd be so much more happier, because mine right now has a very, like blue tinge to it. Being proud, but this is your doing. Until you steeped me in the blood of your own, I was nothing but rotten architecture. You have made me... I think I'm entering my sleeveless era, and I'm kind of stoked on it. Gotta start lifting weights to get huge. Do it, bro. Just listen to Harm's Way, W-H-E-Y. Alright, now we're in this fucking place. 
25th of December, 1899, if you should find this, then you already know all I would tell you. You already know what you have done and what you must now do. Walking away from these temples, that small pile of stones beneath the rhododendrons, the skulls of innocents under the loose clod, headless rib cages, cruelly torn asunder to expose their flowers, and the cool snow behind the altars, 3,000 miles away. I trace my life to this instant. Rain channels eroded in ancient stone. The toxins are already in this damp, this falling water. In an instant, cradling my children's heads in my palms, I knew that I had to unbuild what I myself had constructed. Even then, it was little more than a sickening dream. This machine is ever mine, and it falls to me to redeem it and myself. So yeah, so we built the machine, and this person talking to us is who we think the machine is. So some schizo stuff going on there. And we definitely killed our kids. So that's fun. So this if it's a trail of lies and other caveman shit. Yeah, it's about right. It's quickly injured now. I'm aware of it. cheats no more. It jeers no more. I feel it shut around me. When I'm able press flat to the ground, I feel as afraid of me and I hate it all the more. As I hate myself for unleashing it, my head pounds with blood. My teeth vibrate. I retch and burn with fever. I'm an angel of death, descending to smother the firstborn for the death of the two that came after. In my dreams, I walk with my children. I walk tunnels where no human has trod before. I'm sure of that. It's just me and him now. Frost forms on my coat sleeves. The deathly still in the freezing air tell me I am close. Oh. Can't open any of those? That's fucking dumb. What are they? Regrinding. Oh, not that important. Jug, it's me. What's up, The T Brian? to the T to the S to the B. <laughs> I was wondering what you would eat if you could have any fast food right now. What would I eat if any fast food right now? Um, realistically speaking, Taco Bell. Fuck. I'd get like a big fat fucking burrito and like No, I take that back. I don't want the burrito. I want fucking two chalupas and a cheesy gordita crunch with cinnamon sticks and a ba a ba blast. That's what I would get. Alright, so we go this way. Open sesame. It works. Mandis Processing Company. We're going to distribution tanks, maintenance access. Locked. Locked. If this is my place, why don't I have the keys? Do not expose to ultraviolets. Contains vitae. Oh, so we need to find an ultraviolet. Light. Got it. The question is, where would I find one down here if it's so bad for this shit? Damn it, Meg. Welcome in, friend. What the fuck noise was that? Oh my fuck! Oh, it just appears! Oh no! Oh, this is not good. Fuck! Oh, Here you double G you do a great Hank Hill impression. Do you get to practice that making fun of your Neanderthal neighbor? Sadly no. Oh! Oh, you're not happy with that, huh? 
No, you're not. Okay. I didn't have to defeat him, but I got past him, so that's good. Cool. Oh, the clock ticking was you? I was very confused about that. Fuck. Man's person company. Electrogravatic suppression, South Tower. Shit is be crazy. Thank you for the bits, Tree. Man is descending amongst the spirits. I deny you I'm not your chattel. I will not be your operator, the monkey to your organ grinder. <clears throat> Only to save you. Only to spare you. I would have given my soul to spare you this world. I think we're close. My children. My children. What have I done? What have I become? You're a pig. I will put it right, my darlings. All of my wrongs will be righted. All of my sins washed clean. For killing your kids? No. Your kids aren't going to randomly just come back, man. Sorry. Twentieth December, of 1899. Memories they service like bloated bodies rise to the scum of the Thames. I looked at them, covered in the blood of their dead mother. Little piglets swelling in their swaddling, and my heart at once was filled with a great love and a consuming hate I could never have imagined. At that point, did my soul split, creating him? Was this the egg of my soul at the moment that the great clock began to tick? Is the only path to redemption to join us together again, to make myself whole, to close the great circle and take that madman into my heart once more and forgive him and myself as well? I suppose so. I love you, my darlings, and I am sorry. I am sorry for all I have done. I simply loved you all too much for this world. Listen, let's not try to justify why you murdered your fucking kids with that shit, okay? Mandis is alone. I search for instruction, for advice, for helping my goals, but in return, the system mocks me. Simpleton, it says. You must find your own answers now. Well, of course. Why would that part of my brain want to help me? Fucking sprint, dude. Mandis, put aside your misguided crusade and let me save them. You may <laughs> Thank you, Tree. A far greater slaughter awaits you there. I seek to save the world by oh. right now, before millions fall beneath history, pushed under by blade, bullet, and gas. Fucking what in the ball fuck was that? What the f absolute shit. Oh, you fucking did not. Make sure you stretch out those cream hamsters. I would love to stretch, but I'm a little preoccupied at the moment. I don't know what that means. Oh, God! Please let me go. Please? What the fuck? I ended up back here anyways. Alright, oh, I'll stretch, I'll stretch, I'll stretch. Oh my god. Oh. What is this? Oh, no way.
can't do anything with that. Gotta go to bed, but I hope the rest of your stream goes great. Thank you, Jeff. Have a great night, my friend. I appreciate you coming through and hanging out, and, and obviously the raid, too. This is the part of the game that glitched on me, and somehow I wound up on top of the glass maze. I was walking on top of it, looking down at the monster. That is very odd. <laughs> If we go out through here, we'll start from the outside. What does it say? No sign here. So check this out. Breathe. No. <laughs> Hello? Uh. Just doing this again where I get stuck at random spots on a ladder. Yeah, I got through it this time just fine. I don't know what you're doing. Uh. What is that? I just touch it and it does that? There's a few more over here, huh? Okay. Another. And another. I have you now, creature. I will destroy you. Stop him. Don't make me destroy you. Enoch, Edwin, Oswald, and I. And the game crashed again. You've got to be fucking kidding me. How far back this time? Thank you, Meg. will cheer you up. <laughs> God damn it. Only to save you. Only to spare you. I would have given my soul to spare you this world and its loan. Oh, my children. My children. What have I done? What have I done? You become a, a past version of yourself. All of my wrongs will be righted. All of my sins washed clean. I love you, my darlings, and I am sorry. I am sorry for all I have done. I simply loved you all too much for this world. Mandus, put aside your misguided crusade. And let me save them. You may hate me, Mandus, but I have seen the future, your 20th century. And let me tell you this, a far greater slaughter awaits you there. I seek to save the world by blood now, before millions fall beneath history, pushed under by blade, bullets and gas. Oh, fuck. I was gonna try to play it off as he walked by, but that was not to be. Fuck you! over here the ladder oh like every time I get stuck on a ladder the game's about to crash
I don't know what these magic rock candy things are supposed to be doing, but... It's fucking doing something. I have you now. It is over. It is time to end this madness. All right. Oh, God help me. I am lost in the dried paper soul of the world. Enoch, Edwin, Oswald, and I. Ow. Madness, listen to your heart. You know you are with me. You created me to save the world. I am your friend. How do I how do I cancel this uh this thing from working? There's no button? Alright, I'll go find a button. I can't fucking sprint? Oh, for fucking crying out loud. Madness, please. I am no more evil than you. We sought the same thing. To save humanity. Ridding them of their painful, stupid, pointless lives. Madness, stop. Think about what you are doing. For your children, Mandus. Do not speak of my children, monster. Yeah, dickhead. Your children, Mandus. You sacrificed them on the temple steps, knowing what the coming century would do to them. Your sons will drown, lungs full of mud and shrapnel, on the banks of the Somme. You wanted to save them from the horror to come. That is the vision we shared. Everything we have built to avert this coming nightmare. You and I are one. We are the same. Our souls are entangled. We deserve to make them free. Jesus. Oh, it's the pyramid. They built the machine around the pyramid. Deep in mud and bone and filled my lungs with mustard gas. I have seen two brothers fall. I have lain with holy wars and copulated with the autumnal fallout. I have dug trenches for the refugees. I have murdered dissidents where the ground never thaws and starved the masses into faith. A child's shadow burnt into the brickwork. A house of skulls in the jungle. The innocent, the innocent Mandus trod and bled and gassed and starved and beaten and murdered and enslaved. This is your coming century. They will eat the madness. They will make pigs of you all. And they will bury their snaps into your ribs. And they will eat your hearts. I'm not sure how a machine that I've made up in my head. Oh, God. Found them. Please, Mandus, no. For your children. Hey, Twy. Thank you. How you doing, Twy? Oh, boy.
I can't really do anything here. Oh, there we go. See ya. I'm doing all right. Doing okay, just in bed, sleepy. Very nice. Of course, you can't really see what's going on, but it's uh, it's showing the the top of the pyramid here where we just were. So somehow having the machine rip my heart out next to my dead children is the right way to do this. I, mean, I guess the machine was fucked anyways. And watch the god I had created die. At the end, when we were cold as the stone we had hewn his body from, when the lights were nearly all extinguished, we heard in the silent distance the man pigs singing to one another. The man pigs. Then, as the last lights were gone, and we lay together in the deep, they drifted away, and all was silent. Such a silence I have never known. And as the dust settled on my open eyes, and we lay together embraced forever, I heard, miles above us, the sounds of the city turning over in its sleep. A church bell ringing out. And in that moment, the new century was born. heart so I got five out of the seven achievements apparently I missed two the end yeah, it, was, it was pretty good um, I think I preferred the first one uh, in terms of the overall atmosphere of the game this one definitely had um, fun like visceral shit to it so Gotta go back in and get them. <laughs> Not tonight. Um, yeah, but that's that's Amnesia Machine for Pigs. We have two down, two more Amnesias to go. I hit play. Oh, there we go. Just had a delay in the beginning. Thank you, Twy. I appreciate it. So. We have finished up the second Amnesia game. The third one is Rebirth. Why do I feel like the game, when I change the gamma, change the gamma of my whole fucking screen? This is super bright. Like, my background's super bright. Everything's super bright. What the fuck? This is obnoxious. If you, yeah, my, it's my desktop is super bright for some reason. I don't know why it's doing that, but it's 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 very bright. Like my dark mode is light gray. <laughs> 
Oh, what am I doing? I'm sitting here Googling how to do it. I'm just going to go back into the game and just put it back to default. Dark would say, fine, I have to add fills and OBS so stream viewers can see without affecting my own game. Yeah. I wanted to, I just didn't even think about doing that, to be honest, but it's a very good idea. But I'm in the game now. Graphics. Game was back down to like, we just hit it at one. Now, if I exit, that didn't fucking fix it. What the fuck? Strange for it to affect everything. Yeah, I think it's just what it changed. Oh, I think it just... It's kind of returned. I mean, my eyes are just fucked up from playing that game. It's very possible, too. Let's see. Change gamma Windows 11. Calibrate display color. Ow. Oh. Bro, I don't want this. Get out of here. Yeah, I tried the right click. It wasn't working. It wasn't getting me what I wanted. All right. Settings. Where's my display? Okay, it's under system. Display. So we'll click advanced display settings. Boom. Select the correct the correct one. Okay, so display two. That's the correct one. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Display adapter products for display whatever. Yeah. Color management. Okay. My God, how many menus? Advanced. Calibrate display. I was already at this before, you fuck. So I press, press the next button. Okay. God, why is that the maximize? Chill. Read the on-screen instructions. Once done, click next until you arrive at the adjust gamut page. I hit reset and it did nothing. Oh, there we go. I'm just going to next my way through everything here. All right, cool. I just fixed it. Woo! I swear I said goodnight to you 30 minutes ago. That's not how that works. I sometimes when I look too fast, the emote looks like it's spitting on me, makes me giggle. <laughs> okay, so that's good. I'm glad uh, that's resolved. So, um, I will... I'll ask you all, what would you rather see? Do you want to see me suffer through a few wheel spins, or should we jump right into uh, into Amnesia uh, Rebirth? Because I'm okay with just doing a couple, like... Thank you, Ash.
You vote both? What is this? Suffering. Well, I know your vote already. <laughs> hour. I do have a oh, suffering hour. Yeah, so we have an hour and 10 minutes. Spin. I have two, I have two people say spin it. Knox saying both and twice saying pull. Suffering Hour is a band. Okay, fair. No one is saying just start the game, so I think that's where we're just going to leave it at that then. All right, let's see how many I can do. By the way, I'm not touching that counter yet. This is, I'm catching up on the, uh, the bit of thon ones. Which currently, there's still six more of those. You're barely awake? Well, you'll be able to laugh at my misfortune here shortly. I have a bad feeling on this one. Because I've already done two today, and this one's going to hit. It's going to hurt. Okay, it's not going to... That one's not going to hurt. If Laser's here, she'll be very excited. Because this is... The Laser Lady, Blue Raspberry, Ghost Pepper, Hard Candies. And they're all fucking stuck together. I should have put these in the fridge too, I guess. This sounds so good. These actually are good, I will say. They're just very sticky. And I can't break them apart. Ooh, I think I got one. There we go. That was quite the battle. Alright. You can kind of see it. It looks a little bit like a pepper. And it's like a blue, a light blue color. Yeah, a little bit darker blue, probably in the red. Sticky, calm down, Twy. <laughs> Have you tried the Melinda's brand ghost pepper? Hot sauce is very tasty. I don't think so. All right, cheers to you all. All right. Five more spins for the bit of time. I don't know what. Switch to just chatting. It's adorable. Wow, Z. Twy, thank you for the rage stream points. 93%. Holy fuck. We, uh... Like 3,800 left to go. A little bit less than 3,800 points. And the maximum... Our stream is 2,000 channel points to use. So technically there's two people that have 2,000 points each. They can make the rage stream going to happen. Um, yeah, that honestly, that hard pepper, the ghost pepper candy is not bad at all. So I will spin again. Come on, keep that luck going. Keep that luck going. Thank you, Meg. There's 2,000. No, I thought it was chocolate. No, no, I did so good. Oh, I was doing so good too. Correct, correct, Meg, thank you. Glad this album is about to end because we are going to be switching it up here. Something a bit heavier.
It was jerky. It's it's like a pixel or two over. Actually, there's a there's a pixel between the line and the arrow. So like it's 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 very easily jerky, unfortunately. I needed a couple more pixels and I would have had chocolate and I'd have been like, cool, glap right down. Roll a D20 for it. Why? We just spun it. Do, 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 do. Uh, well, we had Laser Lady's gift, and there's only one other gift so far that's been added to this wheel, and that was Endeavor Endeavors. Revenge of the Reaper, Carolina Reaper Beef Jerky. Hi, I'm Steve-O, and this is the Pussy Blast Off. Riz. Welcome in, friend. You just showed up at the right time, because I'm about to eat something that's gross. Oh. Fuck me in the ass, man. It's... Oh, these hurt, Twy. Between this and the Death Nut, the, uh, the peanuts that are in Death Nut number five, those are the two worst things that I have by far. Just after something good? Yeah. Who just eats that shit like, oh, wow, this is good? Yeah, I, for real, Monster Mom. I don't think anyone does. At least I hope not. You know what I'm going to do first? Before I even eat that, I'm fucking taking this one off the guy. I'm taking it off the spin list. Like the ones that I owe. Um, so, yeah, we're down to four spins for the bit of thon Plus the other, whatever the fuck that is now. You got me curious? Oh, great. I have an addiction to spicy like nicotine. This isn't even spicy. Just It's gross. It doesn't taste very good. They sell it for folk who punish themselves. Honestly, not not far off. <laughs> I think you nailed it. I still can't get this fucking piece of the label off. There we go. Ah. That's like some good fucking brutal death metal while you eat Carolina Reaper infused beef jerky. If it doesn't taste good, I'm out. I want to make my sweat and taste so yummy. <laughs> you want to make your oh you want to want to make you sweat and it tastes good. Yeah, no, that's fair. Like we were discussing, so I have a chocolate bar with habanero peppers in it, and it's like a little bit of heat, but it has all, like the chocolate itself is pretty good. And I was saying like, oh, I should find more of this and use it in s'mores. So it's like a spicy and sweet s'mores. My drinks are typing is worse than normal. <laughs> fair enough, what are you drinking? Oh, there it is. It's poking its head out right there. Gross. Dude, yes. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. All right. This is it. Oh, it's super caked on this one. Don't forget water. Yeah. Yeah. Give me some spicy s'mores. The rest of the mead, they let me take it home. Oh, my God. <laughs> Be careful, bro. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> yeah, basically. So this little piece of beef jerky is about to fuck my life up. You laugh all you want. Look how fucking caked on that powder is. It's fucking... It looks horrid. Like, I'm telling you this... I'm taking a couple of bites and I'm just going to fucking flood my mouth with water because I it, this hurts. This one hurts a lot. So, uh, cheers. Oh, 
Oh, oh God. Oh. It's not fun. Spicy chocolate chip cookie. I made one before candied bacon and a spicy chocolate would work great with those. That sounds really good, Scaredy. Oh. Fuck, put these back in the goddamn fridge. Or, okay, hot sauce. And you two come out too, because I'm sure that's happening at some point. Oh. <sighs> Oh my god. I heard the auga in there somewhere too. And that may have just been the music, I don't know. <laughs> no Soma, no Spin 12. They made green and red chili ice cream and cookies here? I don't know about ice cream. Cookies I would do. Don't they need to be in the fridge? That's why I said, go back where they belong, into the fridge. <sighs> Fuck, like the back of my throat. Oh, and then my ears. It always goes to my ears. Nox meds. <sighs> Fuck. Oh! Ah! when you gagged into the trash can with beans, it would also make me gag. Oh, dude, the jelly beans are gross. Back of my throat, too. Calm down. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, God. And they get old, too. Even the good ones were bad. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm worried about the, uh, the bean boozles. We haven't had one in a while. Thanks, Riz. Yeah, having lots of fun, Meg. Thank you. Oh. Oh. I seen them at the store a while ago and almost got them for fun. Oh, God. I would never fucking gag with that dog throwing up the water meme. <laughs> <clears throat> no, definitely the closest thing that's ever made me, uh, thank you, Soma. Ash, why would you do that to me? <laughs> I do love Ty, though. Uh... <sighs> So the thing that almost made me puke on stream was um, the the dead fish, bean boozled jelly bean. Chewing that more, just like the smell starting to escape, and then the taste was there. Oh, it was so bad. In fact. You can find that clip very easily. It's actually on YouTube. It's part of my uh, top 50 greatest jumps. Uh, well, it's my top 50 greatest clips.
Yeah, feel free to check that video out or put it on your watch later list. Ugh. We watched it at the end of stream yesterday. We'll watch it again here too if you don't like to, if you haven't. But yeah, Channel 13 Horror, Breakfast at Noon, put together a fantastic video of my top 50 uh, jump scares. One of them is actually me gagging on the fucking jelly bean. And it's, uh, it's good. Ugh. It's a lot better than this fucking beef jerky, that's for sure. <clears throat> I think I'm past the, pro uh, the, uh, the peak. It's still it's still fighting. But I don't think it's gonna reach that same peak again. Yeah. Should I choose fish bean or jerky? What do you pick and why? Uh the jerky. It goes away. I don't gag on it. It's just hot and it hurts for a while. The, the fish bean, like, I felt sick afterwards. Like, I wanted to yak. <clears throat> Not only is it just a dead fish, it's like a dead, decaying fish. Like, it's been out of the water for a while. Pecked at by fucking seagulls and shit. <sighs> it, yeah, it was rough. You could smell it. Like, you're chewing and you smell it. I actually had to, I brushed my teeth after stream because I was like, I can't. Oh, I could smell lying in the hot sun. Yep. Mm hmm. Light breeze so it carries the smell around. Ugh. Gross. Ugh. The first clip is the fish bean, isn't it? Uh, the first one? No. The first one's an actual game. I wonder if it'd be that bad with it. I wonder if I'd be that bad with it, too. Only one way to find out, Twy. It made you gag? The, 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 it was a dead fish jelly bean. Yeah, I gagged hard. I almost like, I remember specifically in the clip, I don't know if you caught this part of it because you did cut it. When I swallowed it, you could see my throat regurgitate. I almost threw up. Ugh. Fuck, go away. Ugh. This thing is just hanging around, this one. My God, there was so much fucking, like, coating on this piece. Yazzie. Yeah, <laughs> the burping probably doesn't help. <sighs> Ice time. Ah! Oh. Nothing. Me? <laughs> Just hanging around. Yeah. Thanks for the bitch. There you go, Meg. <laughs> Cookie Chris. <laughs> you got it. Oh. 
Oh, it was so good. Oh. Come on, bolt thrower. Ah. Uh. Uh -huh. Oh, my nose is starting to run. And I still already feel it creeping back. Shit just does not go away. Uh, uh. I was curious to see who's on. Wow, a ton everyone got off. Well, a lot of people did. Diana just got is on recently though. She's playing uh, Diablo 4. Oh. Kareem's on playing Overwatch 2. Grumpy Boy's playing Last of Us Part 1. Nice. Oh, it's his first playthrough as well. And the fish is still going. He's on day 16. Playing Hearthstone currently. Oh, interesting. <sighs> Should go catch it. Wow. Make sure everyone gets off. Hey, you know what? I'm just saying, I'm, I'm a good dude. <laughs> I mean, are you complaining? Don't kink shame me, tree beard. <laughs> it even says on my license I'm an orgasm donor. <laughs> <laughs> I crack myself up, I tell you. Oh, don't yuck his yum. <laughs> right in the yam bag. I'm a licensed tester. <laughs> yeah, Soma. <laughs> Soma leaves the little, like, piece of paper that says inspected by, and it has, like, the person's ID number. It just says inspected by ID 69. <laughs> Ah, uh, this has to go away. I can do another spin. Ah, uh. uh. yeah. I wasn't fast enough. Sorry, hold up. I'll get you there. Ah. Uh. I put it on play next. Inspected by ID. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you know, you know. <laughs> God damn it, Soma. <laughs> uh, oh, I forgot Cookie Crisp. Fuck. I'm sorry, Scaredy. <clears throat> oh. Nope. Oh, that one was a little juicy. <laughs> that song has been stuck in my head all day. Nice. Yeah, Black Breath's the shit. I don't think my... No, it's not in here. Um, I have a Black Breath hat. It's old. It's gone to a lot of shows. Used to pit with that thing on all the time. All right, hold up. Fucking... Come on, ice. Break. Ah! It's this one big fucking goddamn brick. And I'm trying to get... Oh, there we go. Oh.
Well, Spit on the Cross is part of the song name. It's uh, it's Black Sin, and then parentheses Spit on the Cross. See, it weren't wrong. Oh. This one lasts longer than the Death Nut, but the Death Nut hurts more. I think that's the official call. Now they had, I had the Death Nut last night, and now the Reaper jerky today. Fucked. Uh. Oh my god. Uh. Fuck, are you done yet? I got more spins to do here. And, uh. Yeah, we're down to four. Yep. Yeah. Well, that's because that's what it was known by. I mean, again, you're not wrong. It's part of the title of the song, so if it's known by the song title. You keep putting yourself down, and I'm telling you, you got it right. <laughs> uh -oh. Damn it, Scaredy, I forgot again. Mariana, Mariana Cross. God, I'm such a fucking loser. Shut the fuck up. Tree, you asking for Mariana Cross? Yo, Halloween Baca. Welcome in. How you doing, my friend? Ugh. Here, Knox, your song's coming. Here you go, bud. Fucking bastard. <laughs> Thank you for the bits. That was worth. Yeah. Cool down. Ah. Mmm. What kind of whiskey? I just had Carolina Reaper beef jerky that hurts. What? Why does title say it's just Black Sin? It literally says Black Sin spit on spit on cross, <laughs> which is also missing the word the. Fireball peanut butter whiskey that's from Knob Creek. Nice. Ah. Uh. Ah, uh, my fuck. What the fuck? No more. Thank you, Baka. This is a great week. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. This is very true, Knox. <clears throat> Especially this break coming. Yeah, the uh, peanut butter whiskey. Um. The one that I tried, the, the popular one, I think I mixed it with, like, some fruity vodka. Oh, so fucking good. It's like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Highly recommend. Screwball, thank you. This part right here. Uh, oh, kooky crisp. Drink the blood from the cup. Reject Christ, spit on the cross, or just bite the ice cube. 
No, that doesn't work. All right. Oh. Had it straight. Really mixed with drink. Yeah, having stuff straight that's like, I don't want to say gimmicky, but it definitely has like a very, very obvious flavor, like character profile. It's like you almost have to mix it with something. Like I remember uh, a couple of summers, uh, right after I got out of college, a bunch of my friends were super into Loopy from, uh, I think it was Pinnacle Vodka that did it. It was tasted like Fruit Loops. It smelled like it too. And when my friends drank it, they got shit faced off of it. It came out of their fucking pores. I'm like, oh, who the fuck smells like breakfast? Like it was so gross. But like, you had to mix with like fruit punch or something. You just couldn't do it otherwise. <clears throat> they make screwball here. We were the first place they ever sell it. Oh no shit. That's really cool. I didn't know that. Your workplace that is. Oh. Do mine with Bailey's chocolate liqueur and some cream. Tastes like a peanut butter cup. That's some good shit right there. Yeah. There's, um, I found someone, I don't know if they, I think they might be local to me in Massachusetts, but they make like a knockoff version of Bailey's and I've tried them side by side and theirs is way better and like 10 bucks cheaper. I was, I blew my fucking mind. I can't remember though. You could drink gin straight. I don't think I could drink gin straight. Um, I've had gin before, and I haven't been big on it. I've had one gin and tonic, and I was already pretty inebriated, so it was fine. Um, but I have had mixed drinks that have gin in it that have been really tasty. Um, but yeah, I can't say I'm a gin guy. Um, I know we don't know any good gins, that's for sure. Yeah, it's fair, Knox. I get that. I get that. Like with whiskeys, like you throw a bourbon in my face, I'm going to try it. You throw a rye in my face, no offense to fry. Um, I'll try it, but I may not like it. <clears throat> Very floral, or however you spell it. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I've had some very floral ones myself too, and it's not been great. So, Nox, speaking of... Um, Speaking of ripping Teletubbies heads off Doom style, the breakdown in this song too. I don't really like Rai either. Yeah, it's it's um there's more of that spice is in there. Um if Satan was here, he'd be able to explain it to you, like left, right, and center. Uh I mean the guy teaches classes on like on different types of whiskeys. <clears throat> Connoisseur is an understatement. Oh, fucking knows all right i think i've made it did i not send this i thought i said to just chatting why did it go back fucking obs i can't do gym where the juniper is too heavy blood yeah that's what makes it florals the juniper berries yeah that's for sure um okay <clears throat> i'm ready for another spin Let's fucking do this. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's fucking go! Come on. Don't fuck me. Don't fuck me. Don't fuck me. Oh, you didn't fuck me. Thank you. <laughs> E-girl kitten. Ooh, woo, one, two, three. <laughs> Welcome to the mob. Happy to have you. <laughs> oh, all right. That's the Plum Dog Millionaire hot sauce. Okay, that is that's better. That's better. So, E Girl, what brings you in today? How did you find us here? Oh, oh my God, I'm dying. Yo, would you rather watch a tree grow or a? Uh, uh... Yeah, can we not, please? Matt Thick Daddy. Oh, I was talking with you earlier today, Thick Daddy. Why the fuck you all awake, mother of God? 
Because I'm making bad decisions, obviously. Yeah, we, we conversated earlier. Who's, whose stream was that in? Whose stream was that in? I had a few streams open. Was it Sass's? I think it was Sass's. When I did my bar class, we had to taste all 34 bottles of bourbon and whiskey. I was fucking so tipsy that day. I, I can see why. They didn't tell you to spit it out? Damn. <clears throat> All right. Um, <clears throat> yes. So, back on track after that uh, that weird follow and in, in things. Uh, pass it during the last stream. Wake up to your stream. God, we both making shit to say shit. <laughs> Well, I don't know how you got here if it was from Sass. So maybe you had a different tab open. Either way, happy to have you. That was an option I did not take. Hmm. Well, what did we learn? Uh, so let me think. Oh, Plum Dog Millionaire. Yes. Oh. Right in the front row. All right. We finally got past the bullshit. That was the jerky, at least once. Let me uh, take my tally mark off of that. So it's got three spins left. Oh, yeah, I'm drinking. So this is the Plum Dog Millionaire hot sauce. So all the hot sauces here, by the way, are gonzo sauce. Um, <clears throat> someone who used to stream, I don't think he streamed in a while, Um he was an Escape from Tarkov streamer. He actually got me in touch with his brother in upstate New York that makes these. So I, at the time, he had eight varieties. And I said, I said send me a bottle of each. And he was like, uh, okay. It took me like two weeks prior, so I was excited. Oh, wow. <laughs> Do I be called Hallow or Baca? Hallow or Baca. <clears throat> I'll let him answer that. Spin nine, spin four, spin 12. So much quiet. <laughs> so in this one here is a medium to hot rated two out of three it has king star white thai chilies red jalapeno chilies fresh plums carrots ginger molasses and cinnamon off to bed have a great rest of your stream thank you so much i appreciate you i hope you uh have a lovely lovely sleep and um i hope you have a awesome sunday tomorrow <clears throat> cinnamon interesting yeah it's i don't i don't recall having much cinnamon in here i think it's just to kind of like add some it's it, to do some for some reason but it works <clears throat> uh don't turn 21 while working at a bar i had a table full of free drinks and i fell asleep at the bar oh my god <laughs> How many more songs are on this album? I don't remember. Not many. Okay. So yeah, we'll throw in a different Black Breath album. Play next. Okay. <clears throat> Halloween, birthday, get drunk, don't remember the month. <laughs> oh, your birthday's in October? Nice. Nice. Yeah, we have um we do Jugtober around here uh in October. I stream as many fucking days as possible. Um we ra and we raise money for uh for charity, specifically Hope for the Day, which uh raises awareness and uh preventative measures uh for suicide. And uh yeah, we raised over two thousand dollars last year and it was awesome. Also, heading to bed. Have a great rest of the stream, my dude. Much love. Z, thank you so much. Have a lovely evening sleep as well. Hope you both, uh, well, excuse me. I hope you also sleep well and have a good day tomorrow. My 20 was at a casino, so I got to gamble, bingo, shots, all of it. It was so fun. Wow, there you go. <clears throat> all right. Let's fucking drink this shit down. Again, this is Plum Dog Millionaire from Gonzo Sauce. One day, hopefully, will be called Fear and Loathing in Scoville, but who knows? The boyfriend's beat is June like yours. Good move. June babies are the best.
Actually, no, I tasted cinnamon in that now that you said it. Hedge you babies are the best. Ha ha! Ma ha! Ugh. People call me all three, so whichever one. Okay. <laughs> get dumped from a six relationship on my 21st birthday so everyone bought me free alcohol ah, that's probably not the best decision <laughs> i'm sure you had a good night oh does it go with the carrot um i don't really get much of a carrot flavor in there but like if you mash it if you like blend a bunch of carrots up with a bunch of other like liquids and soften it up and it's very mushy like like carrots should feed to like an infant out of little jars kind of similar texture maybe that's why they used it love the beer thank you appreciate it i don't really like it i wish well i like having one i just wish it was a bit more full and i could grow it out a bit more but like it will grow a bit more and then it just stops and it gets little strings here and there. And then eventually I go see my barber and he straightens it all up for me. <clears throat> all right. All right. That was not too bad. <sighs> Three more spins. 30 minutes to go. Fuck it. Come on, baby. Come on. Give me some whiskey. Daddy needs a drink. All right, Bahan Star. Okay, fine. I can work with Bahan Star. Your beard is fierce. Wish mine would grow like that. Only get neck beard. Never grows downward. Oh, that sucks. Mine is, um, it's kind of hard to tell in the light. Hold on. Alexa, change the office light to white. So, like, I have very much darker hair up top. Whereas the hair on my face is actually a lot lighter, like almost a red, but it's slowly starting to turn gray for what it's worth. Alexa, change the office light to red. Okay. Maybe you put casserole on your head hair. It can make it grow. What if it would work for a beard? I don't know. I've never actually heard that before. So if you're going to play the new amnesia, we get a gun and that's all I know about it. Yeah, I saw that much, at least so far. I've tried to avoid as much gameplay as possible. Embrace the gray, it never stops coming. Oh, yeah. No, I actually, I don't actually mind it. The, the concept of, like, because my beard is, well, also hair on my head is also going gray, too. Like, the, the concept and, like, idea of going gray, like, on an existential front, sure. It's like, oh, God, I'm getting old. But at the same time, it's like, I don't know. I feel like it might work out for me. Who knows? <clears throat> uh, but yeah, we did finish up um, Amnesia Machine for Pigs tonight. Um, we're going to be doing Amnesia the Bunk... Uh, not the Bunker. Uh, Rebirth on Monday. Hopefully get that done. I, if it's a one-stream game, that'd be fucking great. Uh, if not, we'll play it again on Thursday. And then we'll probably swing right into the bunker and get that done. Um, Layers of Fear, the third one, comes out this week as well. And we still have Killer Frequency to play also. Amnesia the bunghole. Why? I fucking never. Gray Devil looks better on guys. Hmm. My eyebrows are turning gray and my sideburns. <laughs> but Meg, that's all your wisdom. I went to bed brown. I swear the next day it was gray. What the hell? When did I get old? <laughs> I feel that on my on my shorter end of the deal here, for sure. Especially when Knox is in here, acts like a fucking zoomer. <laughs> the hair closest to my ears. I knew what she meant. I was like, sweet a gun, and then ignored everything else. I was like, I'm going to play this and forget about it. <laughs> Do you still have the toast scene? I don't. I think... um. I know what I'm pretty sure I lost the toast scene when um when my my SSD died in December and I had to rebuild everything from scratch. I just I didn't have the image or anything, so I didn't recreate it. Is stress the same as wisdom? I think wisdom is a byproduct of stress, but it's not a one for one ratio. <laughs> stress also makes us weaker, or at least it makes my heart weaker. Um Okay. 
All right, we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning! Oh, wait, I already spun it. It was Bahad Star. Oh. Okay. I'll do two B Bahad Stars then. I'm like, fuck, I just fucked myself. Nope. We're good. We survived. We're okay. The Amnesia remake is kind of pretty fucked. It might require a little censoring in some parts to let you know when those are. The Amnesia remake? Do you mean the, the Rebirth game? Do a Boilermaker shot. No. Nope. Cheated. Get out of here, Twy. Two ounce hot sauce, one ounce whiskey. What the fuck is wrong with you? Toastino always made me laugh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> just like my little, my face just popped. Hey, it's time to drink. Yeah, I said a problem with that. Yeah, Rebirth? Okay. Yeah, I've heard mixed reviews on Rebirth. But censoring? Uh, I'll have to look up why it has its rating then. Um, for like trigger warnings and stuff like that. Thanks for the heads up, though. Appreciate that. Um, Bahan Star coming up. X2. Ah, there she is. Ugh. One day I'm just gonna like, I'll be smart and on like the the black label I'll put like on in white out like a letter or two letters to help me differentiate from top looking down. Because some of them have different colored labels, but it's like just the the frame of the label is different. But a lot of them are the same color. Very welcome, Jug. I always give a heads up on games. I know it can be triggering for some. Yeah, I, I could have used you when I did Martha is Dead. Holy fuck. <laughs> right had a toast of time. You reread and I spit my water out. <laughs> um, The first one, someone, I don't know who it was. But the first one, I didn't even notice it right away. Because it didn't alert for some reason. Um, I ended up, oh no, it was for Satan. I did one for Riley Gale from uh, Power Trip. That was fun. Maybe I'll bring that back, Knox, and we'll do like a, it'll be like a channel point or something. I think a full explanation on goddamn Cry of Fear. I've heard Cry of Fear is pretty good. I haven't heard of any uh, trigger warnings, but I'm assuming you had some shit. All right, so. If you don't mind, Bahan Star Time has this one right here. See, so he has a little bit of a uh, yellow color on the label. This one is rated hot, three out of three. <coughs> it's not very hot, though. It's a dadle pepper mash, carrots, onion, horseradish root, mustard, vinegar, and spices. Yeah, this one is the uh, more uh, Caribbean style hot sauce. Very tasty, but also very hot. Certain TWs, I'll give you a list, one, and if you play it, I uh, appreciate it. I think it's actually, it's sitting on my desktop right now. <laughs> All right. Hand it up. Two of these babies. Here's number one. Very tasty. Run in for number two. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. oh, yeah, that's not good. That sucks. Thank you for giving the heads up. I think a lot of the times, too, is, I mean, Cry of Fear is an older game, but usually nowadays, uh, when did Cry of Fear come out anyways? Let me go check. Yeah, 2013. Um... So 10 years ago, I don't think they'll have it in here. Let me see. Yeah, I don't really see it anywhere here, but a lot of uh, newer games will have like their trigger warnings actually listed and be like, here's the things that, you know, are it's why you got this rating. 
But I don't think this one has it. <sighs> Those ones Bobby Madison had that. Yeah. Yeah, the uh, unintended sacrifice. One of the bad endings. Good to know. Tight. Ah. Fuck. All right, more ice time. Absolutely try it. I, I get what you're saying. Ah. Uh, thank you for being here, Meg. Appreciate you. I hope you sleep well. And I also hope you have a lovely Sunday, Sunday fun day tomorrow. Oh, oh. Oh, hi, who are you here? Oh. Yeah, my nose is running now. Oh. Fuck. Oh, I have two more spins left. Hold on. I don't, I'm going to go grab a tissue. My nose is legitimately running. I'll be right back. I'm not going to bother with the BRB screen. All right. Why should you do the hot sauce? Makes you want the volcano menu to come back at Taco Bell. Oh, yeah. Volcano burrito with nachos with fire sauce at it was my go-to. I remember that. Yeah. Uh, you can add, um, what the hell's name? Uh, Martha is dead. There is a really, really, like, it's... It's done through a marionette show, like with puppets, but it is um, a depiction um, of repressed memories of severe child and animal abuse. And I was not ready for it, and it shocked me. And, like, I play a lot of fucked up games on here, I'll admit. Uh, but, uh... Yeah, animal abuse just, uh, it crosses the wrong wires for me. So I felt to mention, uh, I say an Alice man is because I was watching my niece and I felt so far bad she was traumatized. Oh, God. Oh, no. I think Knox is playing, um, Alice. Does the dog die.com? And there it was. See, I found out about that site after that happened. Because <laughs> Wheeler told me about it. Because I DM'd Wheeler and said, hey, I know you have your random horror streams. Don't play this game for your stream. Because he raises money for canine companions. It would kind of be a, a little woof. I am. I haven't seen that. Uh, well, there you go. Just in case.
All right. All right. Let's do another one. Another one. Come on, baby. Oh, I saw the nut five there, and I was like, don't you fucking dare right now, Verde. We did the Verde earlier. Um, Here's right here, the Gonzo Verde. It's the green one. I'll read it again in case you weren't here earlier and you missed it. Uh, it's rated two out of three for hot. Has Serrano chilies, tomatillos, yellow seven pot chilies, roasted onion, garlic, cilantro, vinegar, fresh lime juice, and spices. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, so they slowly spoon feed you that shit. And by the end of it, you're like, oh, no. Yeah. That was, that's kind of like with uh, Martha's Dead. It, it gets spoon fed to you, and then, and then it just out, comes out in the open. And you're like, oh. All right, Verde is out. Get this down to a one spin left from the uh, Bitathon. We got 15 minutes left. I think I can do this, or I'll, I'll at least die doing it. And I think that's that's worthwhile. You all were so fucking generous to me over my birthday week. The least I can do is give you some goddamn entertainment. It's like filming at the top. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> All right, whatever. Fuck it. That was too much. Oh, boy. Lady in red is chatting with me. What's up, Lady in red? I'm doing Splendiferous. I found a lot of <laughs> I've had a lot of spicy stuff this evening. Especially the last hour. Cheek to cheek. Yes. <laughs> How are you doing on this fine evening? If it was necessary to let y'all know it'd be rude of me not to. Yeah, I appreciate you, Matt. Absolutely. You know, there's definitely people that are are able to get through games without worrying about what's going on. And for other people, it can it can certainly be triggering to uh, many different reasons and, and upbringings and whatnot. So um, we played Doki Doki Literature Club on here, and I kept the content warnings on and made it very clear that there was content warnings and trigger warnings within, like, the title and everything. And, you know, and it was a shocking game, a very shocking game. Um, I think it was well done for what it was. But, like, I'm not going back to play it. Like, again, would be like, ah, oh, I missed this game. We can play it again. <laughs> uh, just finished playing some Fall Guys with friends. Oh, you're too bad. Baked Potato was just in here talking about potentially stealing people away for Fall Guys. You get any, get any crowns? If you really want to know what happened to her. Oh, reading Sim. <laughs> You got one? Nice. Love to see it. Oh, hi, Tater. Tater, want to come up here? Want to come up? Come on. Nope, she just gave me the look like, I know what you're doing. Tater, you come up. You come up here. Come on. Don't yawn at me. I know you're just doing it to be obnoxious. She's like, shut up. I'm trying to sleep. <sighs> Uh, yeah, I don't think anyone's gonna give you shit and for giving any trauma. If you're just be, if you just, you don't have to give details on things really. It's like, hey, like essay worrying, like stuff like that. Oh, all right. Oh, all right. It'd be stupid. It'd be very stupid. <laughs> there it is. Thank you, Tree. Yeah, exactly. All right. So, 
that counter up there i'm not touching i've not dumped into those i don't know how we're gonna do with those that's so many fucking spins like ugh. it what is it like it's 18 i think right now. 18 with one left over with uh one sub left over am i doing math right two four no that can't be right well okay 16 divided by three is 20 18 okay yeah thank you i wouldn't post a chat personally if someone asked you the details then dm that yeah i only dm people to do so they asked me twice yep perfect sounds like you got it Let's use a calculator i could but i didn't oh but yeah so we had eight additional spins to do that are not part of the countdown up there uh it's from the bitathon uh where every single every two thousand bits we'd have to do some spins. I got a couple done and the rest of them I banked because, uh, excuse me, uh, at least two of the streams I could think of, I was would have been too drunk to do hot sauce. It would have been very bad. <laughs> but yeah, let's do the last one. Let's do this. We got uh, 10 minutes left. Woo! Come on. Send me off with that whiskey. Send me with that whiskey, baby. Come on. Come on. Damn it. All right, everyday hero hot sauce. I can live with that. I can live with that. There it is. It's the last one. <laughs> Twelve is my third favorite pony. There you go. I hope Knox is uh, excited that I'm playing a whole Black Breath album for him now. Whew. All right, so here's Everyday Hero. This one is rated hot, three out of three. So it's up there. Red Fresno Chili Mash, Ghost Chilies, Ancho Chili, Garlic, Ginger, Apple Cider Vinegar, Water, Cane Sugar... Oh, the song is awesome. No love for Apple Jacks? <laughs> oh. Dash Top Pony. <laughs> I know none of their names, so I, I'm going to stay quiet. But uh, I agree with everyone's opinion on the matter. <laughs> Oh, meanwhile, one last hot sauce. Let's do this. Come on, Jug. Do it for the people. Eh. Oh. <sighs> I know them because my son secretly loves them. Gotcha. Applejack would be fourth. Rarity is just drama queen and adorable. I know them because of my ex. He was really into them. Ah. Ah, good morning, Alessa. Hello. Yeah, quite a few hot sauces tonight. I'm, uh, it's hurting. Name all 3,000 plus. Whoa. Oh, Alessa, we're doing fantastic. Ugh. We uh we finished Amnesia, um, a machine for pigs, which is the second one in the series, and we're gonna be starting Rebirth, uh, Monday, and then we'll be playing uh, Amnesia: The Bunker, the new fourth one that just came out later this week, hopefully. Don't be ashamed. I know it was you. <laughs> wow, great here. Hello, wonderful scaredy cat too. Yes, Dash is. <laughs> Oh, shit. Like, this is hot, but by comparison to that beef jerky, 
from earlier. Not nearly as bad, but it's still pretty bad. My nose is still running. I should be awake right now. <laughs> yes, it's almost 2 a.m. Eastern here. Oh. <clears throat> I'm going to say Alessa. See, uh, it's got to be what? Almost 8 in the morning for you? If I had to guess, 7 or 8? Oh. God. Seven a.m. on a Sunday, and I woke up at five without cover, and I was cold. And I went for a shower and sorted Maddie. <laughs> I feel like that in the butt later, hundred percent. Oh yeah, tomorrow morning for sure, absolutely. I'll fucking start pouring a coffee, and I'll be like, oh, <laughs> I have to like run off. All right, let me just erase this. No more spins from the bidathon. That is closed. The fuck down. But I, we still owe what is obviously on the uh, the board up there, <laughs> which, like we we're saying, oh, is uh, eighteen. Oh, excuse me. Whew. it's eighteen wheel spins plus an extra sub in there too. So two more will be nineteen. Um, but yeah, I think that, uh, why is my sinus closing? Don't do that. I think it's time to go see who the hell we're going to fucking raid here tonight. <clears throat> so we're coming down to a close. Let's fucking go. Rainbow, Twilight, Applejack, Pinky, Flutters, Rarity, Luna, Celestia, Sunset, Minty, Surprise, DJ, Pond 3, Derpy, the true hero. I could continue. <laughs> you know what? We haven't raided Grumpy Boy in a fucking minute, and he's playing Last of Us Part 1, which we just finished up here like... Uh... Right before the bidathon, actually, it was last weekend, and I really enjoyed playing it. And I've been watching the show um, with Amanda, and we've only got two episodes left. Really enjoying it. Well, I should say I've been really enjoying it and watching her reactions to like the fucking ridiculous shit that happens. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Whoo. Well, thank you all for hanging. Uh, I'm glad we finished that Amnesia game. I, I wasn't my favorite out of the two so far. I'm um, looking forward to playing Rebirth um, on Monday. We'll be kicking that up. Uh, tomorrow night, it's going to be uh, going to probably be a Channel 13 uh, stream. Excuse me. And, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm just, we're going to be finalizing some, uh, like, who's going to be in it and what time and all that. I'm pretty sure at the times we probably 10 p.m. Eastern when I was talking to Baloney Boy earlier today. But once I have uh, the specifics ironed out, obviously, I'll announce that, along with the rest of uh, next week's schedule. Oh. <clears throat> I should be the Black Sheep and say Machine for Pigs is my favorite amnesia game. I would say it's Black Sheep. I also haven't played the next two. I mean, the next uh, uh, Rebirth could be absolute trash. And the bunker, for some reason, I could not enjoy it all. And I'd be like, all right, cool. So, I mean, it's not wasn't a bad game by any stretch of the imagination. Um, but yeah, we're going to we're gonna raid on over to one grumpy boy. So let's see if the raid button works today. Ooh, it is. It's been really good recently. Enjoying the fuck out of that. Oh, look at the bunker without saying too much. Thank you, appreciate that. <laughs> so yeah, so uh, our boy, our buddy, one grumpy boy is playing Last of Us Part One. Hope you all can hang out for a little bit. Drop a follow if you haven't. Uh, we have some raid messages too. If you like doing the raid messages, 
I hit the wrong fucking button because I am the best. Hello. So the rating socials are coming on in now. So you get the top one there. So if you're a subscriber, you can use uh, our own lovely Jug4 Poggers uh, emote. Otherwise, feel free to use the other one that has the uh, generic red pickaxe. We get a gun that's all we need to know about the bunker. Yeah. All right. Please do subscribe on YouTube if you haven't. Um, VODs such as this stream will be up there. We'll also have clips. Uh, TikTok, you'll find the TikToks, obviously. Um, I also remember to add Discord in there. So please join the Discord if you have not. We have a great time in there. Uh, NSFW meme chats. SFW meme chats, a question of the day bot, we share music with each other, all sorts of good stuff. Oh, and food pictures, pet pictures, you name it. And Twitter's Twitter. It's kind of a cesspool, but I'm there and I make fun of shit. Um, but that's it. I'm out of here. I hope you all have a lovely evening, and I'll catch you probably tomorrow. Bye.